I'm gonna watch this from the other room while I eat. Watch our food Hey, take this too, since it's kind of yours. Thanks. Thank you. That's the last batch of donations. No, it was alright. I got my best time. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Where is it, by the way? I don't know. Alright, I'll tell you what, I'm doing two minutes. Okay. Oh, right. Huh? I guess during this, I'm going to go. No, I I totally I I ended up having to call I am probably going to after Pokemon because. It's still one of the Well, yeah, I mean, I wanted to watch 2D Zelda. Yeah, I want to watch 2D Zelda. The thing is, that you want to be here. It's the only time that they can come. We all have time to do something. One of them I haven't seen fairly big here. Oh, wow. Uh, there should be. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, there Unfortunately, Twitch TV yeah. considers them the same games. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a major difference. <laughs> Weedle, all right, guys? That doesn't matter. I want to be a deal We cut off the donation. We just have to figure it out. They're just because they're still coming in. And theoretically, with the amount that's left, if they're all towards cancer, it's going to be better than that. But I mean, I'm planning on it. Okay, I'm just working. It's pretty much guaranteed to be done. I'm going to I'm feeling a lot better than I did I kind of like to take it my yeah, we need to know where the blue around is going to be played. Yeah, it's probably here, I think. It's pretty much guaranteed. Yes. Yeah, people are too polite about the couch things like, oh, you want to come on this game? Okay. Yeah, <laughs> you know what? Act like I'm not. I'm not yeah. full. I love you. It's cool. You know what? They're just mad because they're just mad because they're not full. Yep. Rich. Bro, Rich. Let me get caught up on some donations. Okay, so uh, a few more donations. Twenty-five dollars from Nicole Said. 
Okay, uh, Shipping us some money for naming the rival of Pokemon Red Slash yeah. Blue. Um, yeah. yeah, we don't have either of the cards wait, right wait, now, though. Oh, sorry, I have my blue here. Sorry, wait. Okay, yeah. Alright. That's a blue one. We're good? Okay. There's only 18 hours left on this one, by the way. We're going to swap it out. Yeah, after this game, we'll swap it. Okay. Who's that? That's. Uh, Yoshi fan. Where's he? If you see Yoshi fan, you can get that turn. Is that missing now? That is missing now. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't seen one of these in years. No, I, I have <laughs> like, no, no, like the case. No, I the yeah, case, yeah. I mean. The case is amazing. Yeah, I need a. Um, I need <laughs> controller too. <laughs> Uh, where's the horror you used? Yeah. Oh, right, sorry. You go grab that. Yeah. 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 It's not like you. Pro gamers can go up there. Nice. I didn't get on the way, Don. Yeah. Yeah. It's cold. <laughs> is that what I think it is? Okay, so <laughs> is it blue? Yes, it is. Yeah. It's blue? It is. Apparently, it's blue, yeah. It's blue. Careful, the stream might glitch if you put it on there. I'll I take the risk. You, it only happens if you like do it more than like what, like six times. And I like I actually never got missing no on my blue cart, but it still would randomly erase. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, mine used to all the time too. The yeah. saving mechanism was very very bad. Yeah, yeah. but but I still <laughs> kept plowing through it anyway. <laughs> all right. So uh. Oh. There's no uh, GBA player in it. Where's really? the disc? Does anyone have a GBA oh, player disc? There, there should have been like four of them just a minute ago. Yeah, there were, but they, that was just to play Kirby, I think. That, yeah. That, but that's why it should still be in there. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah they used one disc to get a whole bunch of systems set up. Do you only need yeah, one? Starts up, we got one. Uh, we got one. Oh, yeah, we got one. We got one. Magic happened. Cool. Oh, oh. 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 And now we have one broken disc there. You got one. You got the balance one? That's mine. Alright. Soul. Soul. Yeah, you got the chicken nuggets, right? No. No? Alright, so just... Alright, so... I have the chicken nuggets, yeah. Alright. You did get chicken nuggets, right? Okay, yeah, they're right there. Okay. I was saying, like, hey, you got chicken nuggets, you're like, no. Like, so we got this. Okay, so before I start, I'd love to thank everyone who made it be Pokemon Blue, because this is by far the superior version of the game. Yes. Uh, and it's won by three dollars. Three dollars! How much did it win by? Three dollars. That's what you just said. Seriously? Wow. Yeah. Alright, so, um. Yeah. Okay, so, um. What? So, okay. You're gonna check notes, right? Okay, come on. Oh. Seriously, less food talk. More Pokemon talk. Yeah. Okay. At the, um. From the start of the marathon, we've had a donation incentive running. That if we raised $151 for it, we'd all sing the Pokemon song at the start of the game. Oh, Alright, so is everyone ready? <coughs> Lee has it up on this computer, and we are going to... Okay. Power finger. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me turn this down first. Alright, alright. <coughs> this is... This all right. video is like on a VHS. With, I pick this this one, is Mike. so old school. It's <laughs> gonna be like... Alright. Um, oh, make sure it's like loud enough, too. I'm, it's on, it's on max power. Okay. Right wow, this is Three, really two, cool. one. I wanna be the very best, like no one ever was. To catch them is my real test, to train them is my cause. I'll travel across the land, searching far and wide. In Pokemon to understand the power that's inside. Pokemon, it's you and me. I know it's my destiny. Oh, you're my best friend. In a world we must defend. Oh, you gotta catch on. I'm on to you. Our courage will pull us through. You teach me, and I'll teach you. Pokemon. Gotta catch them all. Okay. You can't tell me that wasn't worth it. Alright, let's get the sound back up.
Uh, and thank you for not doing the extended version of that song. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's <laughs> what I think. <laughs> Okay, so uh, just to show off the uh, prize for for Pokemon, this is a. Sorry, before you start, I need to check one thing real quick. I think I think it's just this TV, but I need to make sure this is coming in correctly. <laughs> okay, so it's in wow, Dragon Dark CC. Can you just grab it? Oh, okay, yeah. never mind. No, that's All we do is a poker wrap. That All right, yeah, it's just a TV. No, no. <laughs> I don't think oh, anyone knows that. I, whoa, whoa. I know, like, I think Sir VD might know, know it, most of it but most like, of it all of it. I, I, know, I know pretty much the whole thing. <laughs> Right, we can do it then. No! <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not doing it because I don't know. Five hundred dollars. So here's the prize for uh, for this game. Oh, it's a 3D missing no pearler. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> May your data be forever corrupted. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? Missing no or missing no? Missing, missing number. Missing, missing number. number. Yeah. yeah. Well, let's be right. Okay. <laughs> you know what's bothering me about this game's intro? What? The fact that it's always like Gengar versus Jigglypuff. <laughs> Jigglypuff tackling a Gengar is not going to work. No, not at all. By the way, <laughs> by the way, I'm about to clear the save data on this file. Um, this is no. some. This is something I didn't know about it um, at the time. Like my brother has been done, doing speed runs of this game, and if you follow the site, just last week he submitted a 204 and it went up. So, what we didn't know at the time is actually if you clear your save data. Um, the timer actually starts later, so he lost about 35 seconds before huh. before the start of the run, and he didn't even know at the time. Interesting. Anyway, let's get the show on the road, shall we? Yep. How do you clear all save data? Up select B. All right. On on the tile screen yeah. there. Every, okay. every game has a different like combo. Um. Them. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to change the options real quick. Bell off. Star set. All right. Cool. Three, two, one. Boom. You started the timer, didn't you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, starting in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go! Okay, so, this is, um, this is going to be a low glitch, I guess, run of Pokemon. The one glitch I'm going to use is in the Lavender Tower. I'm actually going to skip the entire game con sequence, and that's going to take like 10 <coughs> minutes. Okay, what's the name? It's going to be green, isn't it? Yeah, I believe so. Well, let me go check for you. I have them all open here, so... Yeah, it's green. It's green? Alrighty. My name is Green, apparently. And a more important one. And as we know, our least favorite anything at S tier SDA is... A Venonat! Yes! <laughs> And that is very much thanks to all your donations here. <laughs> yes, especially a certain person's donations. I love your SNK. Just platonically. Okay, I'm gonna grab. Okay, I'm gonna grab the potion in this box because it is absolutely imperative that I win the first fight. That just proves everyone from last year. I see so Green playing the only system. Super Nintendo. I can pretend it's whatever I like. Yeah. Anyway, like I said, it's an, a low glitch run of Pokemon. So if you're familiar with SMK's run last year, I'm not going to do like anything that he did, um, including including like I actually practiced this run. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> oh, you've got no idea what's in store for you. <laughs> That's why he's sitting right next to him. That's exactly right. Yeah, like a splash of color. That's just, I don't know, I, can, I can live with that. It's like red yeah. trying to pretend it's there. <laughs> but as we know, there is only one version, and there is only one starter, and I'm about to pick it. However, before I do that, I'm going to save. Oh, you're going to go for a good stat. I need, yeah. I need good stats at the start of the game. Okay, so I'm going to pick it. What I'm looking for is I'm looking for 11 attack, 11 special, and 10 speed. If I have... Um, okay, what was the name? Built? Uh, B-I-L-T? B-I-L-T. Okay. And the, the second parts are in lowercase if you want to do that. Or... Um, okay, I may actually need to... Oh. I may actually need to <laughs> enter this... I may actually need to enter this a few times because I need to do the save before I pick up the Pokemon because yeah. that's when it's stats are determined. Oh. Okay, so now I'm going to go into my stats screen. Leona has better taste in Pokemon, by the way. 
10, 10, and 10. Okay, that's no good. I'm going to restart. Okay, so... Maybe select stuff. So your enemy chose Trollbazaar. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, basically, the reason to go for high stats like this is it's just going to make the game so much easier. Like, there's a lot of Pokemon in the middle part of the game where you've got... Um... Oh, hang on. Let me get this first. Approximately how long does this normally take? Um... It should not take too long. Now, why, why specifically do you need those stats? Uh, okay. So, I need the stats because there's, like, a lot of Pokemon where you, um, do, like, 90% damage to them if you... Oh. Um, if you don't do it just right. Okay, 10, 10, 11. That's good enough. I'm gonna take two out of three. The chance of getting all three are roughly one in 22. Mm. So... <laughs> I'm not going to sit around for that long because that's just too long. Yeah, that's why I have. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, any two out of three is good enough. Having any one of them makes a certain different part slower. Um, uh, I'm just going to use tackles, even though Bulbasaur's a jerk and growls me first up. Oh, yeah, okay. So, about critical hits in this game. Um, critical hits are awesome because they completely ignore any status effects that have been used on you. So, um, he's used Growl on me twice, and so my tackles are going to do, like, nothing normally. But if I get a critical hit, it bases the damage on as if there were no attack drops at all. Um, okay, so, oh yeah, so that's another good one. Right, but that's going to be a problem later when you're actually using, like, Stat-ups, right? Yes. When you use stat-ups, critical hits work against you. Yeah. Like, for pretty much every fight except for this one, critical hits work against you. <laughs> no matter who gets them. <coughs> so, um, yeah, that's basically a lot of the run is kind of hedging for that. <laughs> okay, so I'm level 6 right now. There's only one mandatory Pokemon I have to fight before Brock, and it's the level 9 Weedle in Viridian Forest. And yes, I am going to fight him at level 6. Nice. Um, so, in order to get the remaining experience to get to level 8, I'm like 11 HP short of that. 11 XP short of that. Damn, Stratos messing you up. Critical hit. <laughs> that would have done 3 damage anyway, actually. Really? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Critical hits are a bit weird. They're not straight up double damage. They're like multiplied by like 1.7 or something. Oh. I don't know. It's... It's weird. We're gonna have trouble every time I see your Pokemon stand. I think BLT. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need to step out and get some food or something? Because it sounds like you're pretty hungry. No, <laughs> we've got Subway coming soon. I should have named them by Tempora or Sushi. Tempora. Ah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. So that so that one wild Pokemon fight. I need to do that so I'm level eight before Brock. That gives me Bubble, which allows me to completely wreck Brock. Yeah, I always picked Bulbasaur, so I had to, like, grind for Vine Whip. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Bulbasaur just is no good at the beginning of the game. Well, the funny thing is that Bulbasaur actually is really good at the beginning of the game, as long as you, you know, grind. Yeah. Well, like, what I mean is, yeah. like, in a speedrun. Like, well, yeah, in uh, a speedrun yeah, setting, yeah. is completely useless. Like, in a regular game, he's probably the easiest, because, like, yeah. you know, the yeah, first, two... first two... I know my first yeah. play, I started with Bulbasaur. But every play since has been Squirtle. Yeah. <laughs> because Squirtle is the only starter. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Well, it's funny because Blastoise is also generally considered the best of the three starters overall, like just in terms of endgame. Yeah, overall, but I mean... Just not in competitive play. <laughs> <laughs> well, none of the stars are especially good in competitive play, but... Yeah, that's the thing. Blastoise just happens to be the very worst. Hmm? Oh, well, yeah, incompatible because he has, yeah, just defense, but... Oh, come on, there's no way Blastoise can be worse than Venusaur. Yeah, Venusaur's yeah. rubbish. <clears throat> we saw that last year. <laughs> <laughs> it, it depends on what you're going for, I guess. Mm -hmm. I'm mostly thinking in terms of the moves that Blastoise can learn, mm -hmm. because Blastoise can learn ice-based moves, which is very helpful against Lance, for example. Yes, mm -hmm. absolutely. And none By of the, the way, Lance is still can. the worst fight in the game, no yeah. matter what you do, because Gyarados is evil. This was great competitively, just solo beam to the knee, bam, done. <laughs> did you really say that? Yes, I did. <laughs> and I am not ashamed to say it. 
I am ashamed of you for yeah, saying, get off my couch. No, no way. You can get four. Okay, so that's three encounters in Route 1. That's kind of iffy luck. <laughs> Any more than that is really bad. Um, reset? <laughs> yes, reset. Um, <laughs> uh, in all seriousness, like, a lot of the how fast your run is comes down to this encounter luck in the early game. Uh, there's this, there's Viridian Forest, which is... Viridian Forest is actually really weird. Like, in Pokemon Yellow, they jack up the encounter rate so high. Yeah. Um, like, in this I'm going to get through Viridian Forest with, I'd say no more than two, but I'm just kind of condemning myself to getting four or five now. Um, but, in Pokemon Yellow, they jack it up so high that you'd never get out with less than five. And of course, you also have like Wild Pidgey Odors to contend with in there too. Yeah. Getting a couple of, um, a couple of the cheap potions on the way. Wasn't there like some guy you could talk to that gives you a potion? Yeah, there is, but he's too slow. Yeah, okay. <laughs> because maybe the thing to note is that in the more glitchy version of Red and Blue, like in terms of running it, Charmander is usually considered slightly faster than Squirtle just because of uh, the fact that you can skip Brock, and there are an abundance of bug Pokemon early in the game, which fire, which is fire strong against. So that is sort of the one instance where you pick somebody that isn't Squirtle. It's also it's also faster, and that's gonna matter on a couple of Pokemon at some point. Yeah. yeah. So you got something wrong. That's supposed to be a Weedle. <laughs> <laughs> so for this particular category, you're not gonna skip Brock, though, right? I'm not gonna skip Brock. I'm not gonna skip any any yeah, major gym leaders. Well, I mean, you can skip the fighting gym. <laughs> fighting gym. <laughs> It's a gym. It says gym on the outside. No, no. It's Gaim. Gaim. Oh, I'm sorry. It's oh, not... Gaim. <laughs> uh, intro... Yeah, um, okay, you okay. can actually get screwed here if you run into a wild Pikachu. <laughs> 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 and it's like one of the least common encounters, too. Like... Yeah, it's like... Zero. I think it's 1% to find a level 5 Pikachu, but if it's faster than you, you can't run from no. it. You're just screwed. <laughs> I think it's like the only time you find like an electric Pokemon for like the power plants. It's true too. Like yeah, there are no nothing. electric Pokemon in the game. Like, oh no, there's Voltorbs outside Rock Tunnel as well. Oh, that's oh, true. Yeah. Right. I, totally I, I never go by Rock Tunnel, I always see yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to use two Tail Whips at the start of this fight and pray that this doesn't poison me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> this, this Weedle is the worst. See, Blue is slightly better just because they're the... Uh, yeah, yeah, you don't encounter them in um, in, in as wild. much. As yeah, much. it is possible to get them, but it's well, it's more more yeah. more likely than Pikachu. But it's just this one Weedle here is. I think it's like eighty five percent chance of of uh, a caterpillar. Caterpillar, caterpillar or metapod. Like, oh my oh, god, two no. so crits! Are you serious? This Weedle's got game. <laughs> it's okay as long as this tackle hits. I'm good. Don't be critical. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So that should kill it. Yeah. Right. And so now all I do is use an antidote and a poison. Uh, po <laughs> antidote and a potion. All right. You killed that. Okay. Bubble. So now I've got bubble, and yeah, so like now I can bubble. completely wreck bro. Yeah. They're in that bubble. Uh, I'm I'm gonna gonna do some donations that make bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go for it, man. Cool. Uh, we've got twenty dollars from the Sea Wolf. Another day, another donation. Here's 20 bucks to name Ness's favorite thing SDT5K after the newly named Super Death Tornado 5000. There's a power that would make even the newest age retro hippie tremble in fear. <laughs> Thanks again to all the donators out there for this outpouring of love and money for PCF. Thank you very much, Ness Evil. Uh, I don't know why people walk around the right side of this guy, just walking around the left side is completely quicker. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> well, we just want to get as far away from him as possible. <laughs> yeah, unsurprisingly this boss is a bit of a joke, even when you're severely underleveled. Um, having the level 11 special uh, having the 11 special at the start there means that I'm guaranteed to hit the, both the Geodude and the Onyx. However, the Onyx is faster than me, and it can use, um, Bind? Oh. Yeah. Which is not the best thing in the world, but, um, it's not especially accurate, so it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. This is the point in SMK's run of this, because he didn't just one-shot the G.O.D. with a Thundershock. 
Yeah, he one shot the sprinkler with the thumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, it's definitely <laughs> exactly like that. Yeah. In the game. Okay, so I'm gonna check my stats again real quick. Uh, 16, 18, 18. Wow, that attack is really bad. But the speed, <laughs> the speed is really good, and the special is okay. Mercifully, attack is probably one of the least necessary stats out of the four. Yeah, it yeah. is. Oh, defense is clearly the least useful. Yeah, right okay, now, fine. But um. It's just special yeah. is much more important because it constitutes both your special attack and your special defense in this game. Yeah. Yeah. That's why psychic Pokemon are so good. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Okay. Time for the first shopping trip. This is, um... These are important. I've really got to remember what to buy. I'm... <laughs> I'm kind of going to wing it on potions, I think, but... Okay, so first thing I'm going to sell the TM I just got. I know, I could... Pay damage back double if I really wanted to. <laughs> oh, pay back double. Okay, I'm gonna catch two Pokemon. I'm gonna buy three Pokeballs just because there's a chance of things going wrong. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna buy one Escape Rope. Mm -hmm. um, no, it's actually not for oh, Cinema. Really? Okay, so I'm gonna buy a couple of Paralyzed Heals and a couple of Awakenings just to account for potential luck later on. Um, and I'm gonna buy, what is it, 11? 11 potions. Yeah, that sounds about right. And four antidotes. I'm gonna walk out of here with one dollar. Yeah. Oh. I love how hardcore they were about money in this game. Like, you had to get the trainers and fight the money because there was no other money besides that. Yeah. Um. Actually, in general, the balance in this game is actually really good. Like, <laughs> you. I uh, like in terms of how how well leveled the Pokemon are when you get to them. Yeah. If you do everything in the intended order, it's you're like generally right there. Yeah. The whole time. As opposed to some JRPGs that you uh, I can't remember if it's Tackles or ta oh, Bubbles. It probably should be Bubbles, actually, because my attack is so low. <laughs> yeah, just, just in this instance, yeah. Yeah, so the problem, is, the problem is, the way, the way you do it, you use all 30 of your Bubbles in this stretch, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, SMK? Yeah, we'll get the drawings for the two Oh, sorry. Yeah. I'm gonna cross in front. Do you have any time that's, like, free? <laughs> All the time. I don't know, you might need to bash at just the right thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a down B probably. This one is... No, 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 okay. I remember. Weedles or Tackles? Yeah, that did nothing. No, that did nothing at all. <laughs> there we go. There we go. <laughs> Critical hit and speed fall. Uh, speed fall, the fact that Bubble can cause your speed to fall is actually about to become incredibly important in the next fight. Next fight is a guy we dubbed Shorts Guy, and he's an absolute jerk. Uh, he does love the short stuff. That is true. Yes. So if we get through a few more donations here, yep. uh, five dollars from Daniel Pierzer. I like what you're doing. Small amount donated. Uh, ten dollars from Philip Alexic. Or yeah, Alexic. Here's ten say from me. I'm gonna save I'm scared. <laughs> Very yeah. wise. Here's ten from me. I want to donate five. But he can, here's another he can five. take a ton of potions. They are comfy and easy to wear. Thank you for informing us on this. Problem is that, that is. um, Sorry. like. Rattata here has Tackle and Quick Attack, and they run off what's called the same type of attack bonus. Because Rattata's a normal type, um, oh, and this could be bad too. Him using Tail Whip in the... F okay, so he got the Speed Fall, so unless he uses Quick Attack, I'm actually now faster than him. And yeah, this is the problem we're going to have. Oh my god. This is going to take like five hits to kill. Ugh. Yeah, see, this is where we got trouble because now oh, I'm gonna have critical to. <laughs> yeah, now I'm gonna have to use a potion. Uh, you think bubble won't kill? It will, but if it uses quick attack, I'm dead. Oh, good point. <laughs> okay, so that was lucky. All right, so now that okay, so this this fight is a real problem if we've got low speed because Ekans has rap and he's not afraid to use it. <laughs> However, because I'm high speed, I'm gonna be faster than I hope. Good thing he's not using that. I can't imagine he's very good at seeing Ugh. And because it's a critical hit once, it's going to be a critical hit every single time. Oh, really? Yep. yep. So, um, as far as, like, defense against special, is that dependent by just your special stat? Yeah. Special yeah. stat is special attack and special defense. Okay. 
Alright, so because I got, he got wrap off, time to use a potion. <clears throat> and by the way, the fact that that reptile used two tail whips on me means that I'm just getting wrecked. But, oh my god, why didn't I use bubble? Tackle is actually only 95% accurate, so <laughs> you really don't want to use it if you don't have to. That was like 85. 95. I think it was downgraded to 85 in the later version. Really? Yep. I think so. Yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, yeah, I can really use it now. Cool. Uh, $10 from Clinton Nichols III. Mirror is my favorite power, so I'd be dumb if I didn't donate. Put this $10 toward naming Squirtle built. If you have noticed, that we're a bit behind here and we're trying to catch up here. They're, uh, they were all entered, though. Yes, they were all entered. Yeah, I think the Weedles, Tail Whip, and Tackles, and then you switch the bubble. Uh, $10 for from else. Alex Wanshara. Awesome stream all around, guys. Came in with Trias' awesome Yoshi Dog <laughs> run. <laughs> oh my god. And I've been trying to stay on the 95% accurate. Yep. <laughs> this 10 is for the Galacta right, Galacta Curler. And saying. the plushie yeah. at the same time possible. Yes, Always. it is possible. We'll be putting more in, hopefully. Okay. Kirby Cam is the Did you forget to like go to the Poké Center after the. Uh, no, 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 I didn't. I, I did not forget, don't mind. Uh, no hopefully, more like your turn. I love knowing all these random things like this game. It makes no sense to anyone else. Uh, things in the game or why you want to know them? And just the fact that I know him, that it makes no difference if I know him or not. Like the giant list, which is, involves this, the generation one Pokemon It's crazy. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Ten dollars from Rebecca Gribbing All Fours. Kirby Plushie, Should jump into my bed. Yeah. Kirby Plushie, you can yeah. sleep on my head. No? You are so cute and pink. I prefer you to mink. Kirby Plushie, I love you so, and you should follow me wherever I go. Thank you for that uh, touching, touching poem. Inspiring. Yeah, it was, truly. So yeah, the cocoons and minipods suck. They're completely useless. <laughs> well, I mean, like, if you actually train one up, they have tackle, but I think, like, as far as enemies, they always just have hardened, right? Yeah. Except in the yellow version, there's one person who has tackle. Oh, that's, that's, that is correct. that's incredible. But that is not yellow version. Mm -hmm. Thankfully. Alright, so I think I've got three bubbles left. Yeah. It's actually deliberate. Like, you don't use bubble after this, because after this fight I'm going to level up to 15, I'm going to learn more to go. So it's really nice timing, yeah. Oh, uh, we have $10 donation from Samuel Glennon. I'm voting for Pokemon Blue. Looks like blue to me. All right. I see some spots of red. <laughs> <laughs> there are some spots of red. It's trying to get in there. Okay, yeah. You can look them up on your machine. That's now blue guns. That Rex Metapod. Okay, so we have our. Uh, okay, so now I'm gonna catch a Pokemon. Oh, we're gonna catch a Pokemon first. Oh my! Oh there my we go. God. There we go. Okay. Pikachu. Uh, there's a 95 percent chance of Pidgey or Spearow in here. Doesn't matter which one I get. I'd slightly prefer a Spearow, but it doesn't really matter. How many Pokemon are you planning on picking up? I am going to pick up either two or three. Okay, okay. so I'm gonna catch the Pidgey. Oh, down You're B. Down B. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, okay, uh, does Worcester have any opinion on this? Oh, we always do it, just because <laughs> it's what we're used to, but... Yeah. <laughs> you have to. Uh, but, yeah. It... Oh, Mike89, the Englishman says hi. Ah, oh, hi, the Englishman. <laughs> okay. Um, now that Pidgey is caught safely, uh, we can announce winners for the Galactonite Hurler. That is... Okay. That does go to a. Uh, yeah, I'd just like to well. say that Mount Moon sucks. <laughs> this is the last area of real um, enemy randomness in the game, because after this I'm going to get repels. Yes. So now that you got water gun, I guess you don't have to go to the Poke Center, right? I do not have to go to the Poke Center. It's amazing how few I use, actually. <laughs> right now, if I die, I'm going to go back to Power Town. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, congratulations to Mount as well for the Perler. And for the plushie, uh, what's that under? 
Alright, Kirby Mirror plushie, there it is. <coughs> plushie, congratulations to Aaron Ritter. You win a cute pink soft thing. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Actually, I'd like to correct myself. Apparently, its accuracy was increased to 100%. Oh, uh, really? In Generation 5. Every other one is 95. That's sweet. Why would they do that? Yeah. yeah. Well, speaking of inaccurate moves, so <laughs> tough speedrunners, yes. I guess. Okay, TMO one is Mega Punch. I absolutely need it to beat Misty. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I said this like half an hour ago. If I encounter a Clefairy and not a Paris, I actually want a Paris in here because I need a Pokemon that can learn Cut. Yeah. Uh -huh. And while Clefairy can learn Metronome, and that can sometimes give you Cut, <laughs> that doesn't count on the overall. <laughs> <laughs> that would be great if, if you just use metronome for everything. And then just, yeah, it, no, like a really glitchy run that you use metronome and it can just randomly use an HM. Yeah. <laughs> like a outside and use strength. Speaking of metronome and HMs, I think the best thing I've ever seen in any Pokemon game is one time I was playing Pokemon Stadium and um, one of the trainers has all Pokemon with metronome and he managed to get Golem to fly. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, that would be so great if you use metronome on the world map. Okay. Then, you just, then you go to like SSN and use Surf and Strength and Rock and just get you and break the game. <laughs> okay, I am going to kill one Geodude because I think it's going to matter later on. Mm -hmm. I think it'll get my level to 24 when I need it to. How many counts is that? Five or six? In here? Yeah. Uh, one, two, three... I think it was three Zubats, a Clefairy, and... The Geodude, yeah, that's five. So this is six. It's either six or seven. Anyway, this has probably been distinctly average so far. About, about 10 encounters through here is average. A uh, dollar eleven from Jason Vines, named Squirrel Geofrey. Named I didn't teach Mega Punch! No, no you did crap. not. Oh, oh my god. Is this going to be serious time now? Actually, no, it's not going to be a huge problem because you use Water Gun on this, and I think you use Water Gun on the Zubat, so... Okay. Or at least I will just because my um, attack is so rubbish. Yeah. Actually, that's going to make Misty a real problem, <laughs> having such bad attack. It's definitely going to be a good save before that. <laughs> yes. It requires so, much Okay, now this Zubat has Supersonic, <laughs> so this could be really yeah. bad. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's oh, good. That's sad. Okay, oh. how much does it do? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, take that one life back. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, oh that's hard. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Lucky. Supersonic is actually really inaccurate. It's only 55%. <laughs> okay, so I... Really dodged a bullet there. Yeah, okay, do, do we get attacked? Do we get attacked? Alright, crisis averted. Uh, $30 from Stephen Compton. Oh, Link do not touch anything, anything, do not touch do not anything. Touch. I really need more tall for the next fight. Yeah. <laughs> $30 for whack. Keep going, keep going. Okay. Oh, also apparently we have just broke 98000 Oh, oh nice. Awesome. Okay. Right now, I'm gonna use... Uh, should I use two potions? I feel like I should. Punch this time? Yes, I'm gonna learn Mega Punch this time. <laughs> like, I know you don't really name any of your other Pokemon, but the Paris, if you catch him, I'd like you to name him Crawl Sagan. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I'm not a really good chance of getting one, there's not much amount of moon left. Hmm. That's really awesome donation time, Yeah. Yeah, um, <laughs> and okay, so Carl is uh, uh, in the chat, so he is, uh, yeah. Uh, Thirty dollars from Mikhail Sigmundson. <clears throat> yeah. Love the event. Been watching most of it, even at work. Only taking breaks to sleep. Would love that Kirby plushie. Put this toward mm -hmm. cancer being the rival name. Last year was great. Greetings from Iceland. Yeah. Oh, it must. Oh, that would be real trouble. Oh, that would. Uh, uh, full twin. Ooh. Voltorb has super low defense, but high other stats, yeah, specifically it, speed and special. Yeah. So that's specifically why. speed, yes. You feel like oh, the okay. speed period, right? Screech, yeah. Where are you getting this kind of luck? Like, that's I, only two! When I did practice this game, I could never hit the Voltorb. <laughs> Ever. That's not even when the worst one. When did you practice one. the game? Huh? When did you practice the game? For last year. Yeah. I actually did practice it. Really? Oh. What? Really did you see uh, $10 from Daniel Robson. Alright, let me grind it. So, like, on your version of Yellow that you're Oh, you! Did, did, did oh. you learn the teleport? Pardon? 
On the version of the game you're practicing on, could you learn the teleport? No, no, I, did I not tell you what that was? There were one of, like, four Pokemon I could use for teleport, at least I thought. It was actually three, because Venonet couldn't learn it. I had uh -huh. done with the three. That's the, Those are the ones that I actually had run with. I just hadn't tr done a single run using Venonet before. Yeah. I see. Ten dollars from David Archie. Awesome job. Yeah, Helix. I'm taking the Helix Fossil against my wishes. Yeah. It's actually one tile slower to take the Dome Fossil. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> awesome job on the games this year, guys. The OOT run was insane. Uh, 20 from Mark Dolling. Donation towards Pokemon Red. Braving the Australian early morning to see it. Yeah, represent! Right. I'm just gonna keep going. Okay, okay, so because I did not get a Paris, I'm gonna try for Sandshrew in here. Come on, Sandshrew. I'm okay with Sandshrew being called Sandshrew. Come on, Sandshrew! Totally okay with that. Uh, twenty dollars from the Englishman. Spear I can't load cut, but you can trade it for Farfetch, which you can. However, that's slow, <coughs> and I'd like to avoid this fucking like animation. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Carl Sagan, that's you. All right. Uh, so now, what am I gonna do? Um. Bubble kill it. I uh, I don't okay. have any. Okay. Well, you have a really low attack. <coughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Although Mega Punch is probably gonna kill it. We'll see. Twenty dollars from the Englishman. Holy guacamole! Wow. Uh, that's not looking good for Misty. Sanchez is a really high defense. Ninety-seven thousand yeah. dollars already. It hasn't even been twenty-four hours since I left the Forex Center, and already I. You gotta time it. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh what? Yeah. Okay, I got one Close more. Two. Down beast. <laughs> good. Uh, I miss physically being. Yeah. 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 That yeah. actually really would have sucked if I didn't get it. <laughs> that's your last Pokemon. Yeah. yeah. Keep up the amazing so work, everyone. Um, Carl Sagan? Carl Sagan. Carl Sagan, Carl Sagan. Sagan. yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll try to watch as much as I can as the new Canadian University term start, or begins. <laughs> good luck, the Englishman. Thank you for coming. Um, too good. Too good. <laughs> you could have even put the space Carl in there. Okay, I so... I was always a big fan of Sancho as a kid. Alright, so now I don't have to get the Lapras. Awesome. So that's going to save me a bit of time. That is actually the only difference between blue and red. Really? <laughs> yeah, you, sense, you can actually... The mod them. is down here, yeah. Okay. I'm going to do an experimental strategy. I'm actually going to buy a super potion here. Uh, what that's going to do is it's going to buy me more... To what the hell? <laughs> Where's the... You idiot! There's no super potion here! What are you talking about? <laughs> right, maybe a version difference might he's be been, <laughs> <laughs> He's He's been running fire red too much. That's the problem. Anyway, I'm going to take this Pokemon Center just in case things go wrong. Makes sense. So you're planning on getting a super potion. I was planning on getting a super potion. <laughs> super potion for next year's rival? No, it's devastating. No, it's certainly not. We and well, I, I, we trust, I trust I trust more than I trust my own planning on this game. So <laughs> I, I don't think Mike 89's is playing in as bad a position as I'd be. Yeah, I always love going to hospitals and hearing, "I hope to see you again." <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, um, this is Goldine. Um, Goldine's actually kind of schizophrenic about its move set. It's it's like a water Pokemon, but it's got yeah. Heck like a flying Pokemon, and it's got Supersonic like a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, yeah. so this should sorry, be. Mike. <laughs> he said sorry to me. Yeah. yeah, um, yeah, he's been running Fire Red a lot, and I think you can buy Super Potions there and fight. Oh, that's that's really bad. <laughs> You're supposed to two hit this gold Yeah, even with, even with the tail whip, you can do it on the Oh, oh this is trouble. Oh, <laughs> It, it, not necessarily in this fight, it's it's the Starmie that really scares me. Yeah, because so Starmie has Recover too, so... No, Starmie doesn't have Recover, yeah? thank goodness. No, sorry, no, Star U? Which nope. one? Yeah. No, neither of them have Recover. Is that in yellow, then? Yep. The problem is, yellow okay, 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 so okay, I want to yeah. talk a bit about critical hits before I do this. I'm going <laughs> to use a potion and then I'm going to save. Okay, um, basically, critical hits in this game, um, normally it's a, in games after this one, it's a flat percentage. In this game, it's based on your base speed, and base speed is like the lowest possible it can be at level 50 or something like that. Um, and it's that number divided by 512. So, most Pokemon have probably about a 15% chance of a critical hit at any given time. Stami has like 30. <laughs> wow. <laughs> X def oh, X defense. Yeah, which kind of negates my tail whip, so I've got to use another one. <coughs> I'm just thinking, wow, it's not going to watch out this thing anyway. Starmie's critical rate is significantly higher. Yeah, it's, it's something like 25%. There we go. Okay, so I'm actually going to use a potion now. Yeah. As much health as I can have for Starmie, the better. 
and watch the next three Mega Punches and Miss or something like that. Oh my god. <laughs> How are you giving a kind of Mega Punch luck? Like, have you missed one? It actually hits six out of seven times if you haven't noticed. Oh boy. Really? <laughs> Honestly. Supposedly. Supposedly, yeah. Yeah, and the thing is when Starman gets a critical hit with Tackle, it does like 14 damage. Well. Okay, that's minus two, so let's okay. start attacking. Okay, good, good. Three dollars from Sebastian wow. Bebop. So this might actually three hit still. Ooh. Yeah, there's the crit. There's the crit. Okay. Carl Sagan might have to close this out. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to use like three potions. Yeah. Well, at least two. Extra. Oh, actually. No, I don't need to now. Actually, that extra defend will probably save it. Oh, no, okay. Well, then you can just use a water attack to finish it off. Uh -huh. Yes, I can, actually. <laughs> I've never done this before. It's finished it off. Uh -huh. with water. <laughs> There's a reason for that, though. It's more accurate than, yes. than Mega Punch. Yes! <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. Right. not 100% accurate, but more accurate. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. Good, good. Actually, that's a funny thing about this game. Even if you use a 100% accurate attack, it can still miss. Yeah, yeah. there's a 1 in 256 chance. Yeah. Basically, what it does is it rolls... Um, for every attack, every attack has an accuracy rating. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Every, um, oh. Okay, oh, I am going to teach Bubble Beam now. I've forgotten to do this as well before. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, each, Pokemon, each attack has an accuracy internal number between 0 and 255. Um, when you use an attack, the game rolls a random number between 0 and 255. And if the accuracy number is greater than the um, the random number, the attack will hit. Hmm. Programmers out there should know that the correct algorithm was greater than or, or equal, equal to. Or equal to. So if you roll 255, the attack misses no matter what it is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Classic off by one error. Nice. Even nice. Swift. Yep. <laughs> which can, in normal circumstances, never miss. I've seen it miss many times. <laughs> So yeah, based on the amount of attacks I use in the run, I'm good for that happening about once. <laughs> yeah. I expect it to happen once at some point. As long as it doesn't happen in Surge's gym, I don't care where. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Actually, Saffron Rival's probably pretty scary too. I just got a quick thing. Um, the Super Potion has already made the blooper thread. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> it's not a Venonat though, I'm sorry. Yeah, you can't teach a Super Potion teleport. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, while he's fighting Pidgeotto a few this more. This Pidgeotto wow. is a bastard. <laughs> Sand attack is atrocious because it leads with Pidgeotto, and as soon as your accuracy is lowered, it doesn't matter what you do, you'll miss like half the time. Yeah. It's so dumb. <laughs> Luckily, Abra's not exactly a threat. Except that you'll miss with Mega Punch like half the yeah. time. Well, Abra no, this is so fast. <laughs> yeah, this is just time. Like, who cares? Rival's such a better trainer than you are. How do you catch an Abra? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Patience. Patient. Yeah, no. Yeah. Well, because Abra's the stupid one that you can only just throw yeah. Pokeballs at, nothing mm. else. He's still patient and skilled, but his grandfather does not know his name. <coughs> yeah. You can get one Great Ball, actually. Oh, oh. this could be bad. Oh, you got seeded. Shoot. That yeah, could yeah, also be bad. Yeah, that's that's actually Oh, good. nice. Oh, wow. Great. Good. Okay. Alright. A water attack? Huh? Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah, it, what a... Oh, I forgot I've got Bubble Beam. Yeah, yeah. like... Uh, uh, now yeah, I not now. Punch. Yeah. The problem is that minus two. Oh, another crit. <laughs> nice. oh. I'll take that. Alright, a few more donations here. Thirty dollars from Andrew Whistler. My second thirty dollars for another crack at that master sword. Also put this towards Oracle of Seasons and the Save the Frames Foundation. <laughs> Save the frames. <laughs> Ten dollars. Oh. 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 Bye. Bye. So I don't know what he just said. Something about Bill and Pokemon and I don't know. Yes. Story. Uh, apparently, it was important. Ten dollars from our favorite Cyberbot X. Gotta catch him up. Wait a minute. Is that missing though? No. And put this toward SDA as favorite thing for Earthbound. Um, okay, so fingers crossed. 18 special yeah. at level 11 makes this a lot, a bit more dicey than having 19. Right. Because basically the strategy here, the reason you do Misty first is because Bubble Beam absolutely slaughters Nugget Bridge. Yeah. <laughs> if your special is not very good at the start of the game, this becomes a lot harder because things start getting attacks in on you. Especially these Pidgeys, as mentioned earlier. <laughs> Pidgeys are bastards. 
<laughs> they're like the early, they're the only like early game Pokemon that knows Sand Attack too, and it's really dumb. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, Quick Attack like that's better than Sand Attack. I don't care that waste. Well, time. at least at least uh, Built here has defense against Quick Attack. Yeah, these Nether Ants will tank a hit. Well, or okay. not. The later one will, because it's two levels up. Yeah, N Nidorans tend to have higher special than mm -hmm. other early game Pokemon, so... Yeah. Uh, $90 from Susan Bowen. Great thing you're all doing, and keep up the good work. Thank you very much for that very generous That's donation. Uh, $20 so this... from Matthew Sutton. You're doing great work, guys. Fantastic runs for a fantastic cause. I'm particularly looking forward to this Pokemon run. Five dollar donation from Max Shaper. Good luck with Pokemon. I hope you practice more than SMK did last time. I uh, practiced. <laughs> <laughs> it was so just his, that one thing. Like, <laughs> though his commentary was awesome. Greetings from Lichtenstein. Yes. Yes, his commentary was awesome. That was his only utility in terms of Pokemon. That's why he's here. <laughs> Mike, I don't think you did practice in this video. I did. Like, I practiced it all of twice. I'm you watched me stream it. Yeah, I watched the stream. <laughs> practicing. I heard you play practice. practice it. That's why you there would be a super coach in there. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, it, like, Worcester only told me about that last week. And, like I said, he's been running Fire Red, so... That's probably where he got it from. To be fair, Pokemon doesn't really need all that much practice. It's memorization that's key. Like... And you need to know what you're doing. Yeah. It's not execution. Skills. Huh? And judgmental skills if you get into weird situations. Or if you get into weird situations, but I mean, whatever. That's what I have the chat for. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have the chat donate for every movie during the Pokemon fights. <laughs> No, be... they would just ask me to do Mega Punch every single time, yeah. <laughs> and never delete it, which I'm about to do, by the way. With um, body slam on the SSN, so it's not too well, far. Well, I'm not away. about to. I thought there was like a change there. Yeah. Well, no, no, no. I'm gonna learn bite pretty soon. That goes over bubble. Yeah. Um, actually, you may notice I've got three water moves at the moment. Uh, at some point in the run, I'm gonna have none. <laughs> yeah. It's not for very long, but I do have none at some Wait, point. Wait, who's learning Surf? Um... If you're not getting Lapras. Nah, Blastoise takes Surf, well, but... Well, it's a water move, you can't er erase it. Well, yeah, 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 but it's before then. Oh, I see, okay, yeah. It's not at the end of the run I'm gonna have none. Okay. During Saffron, I have none. Said at some point. Right. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Uh, My listening skills are off. <laughs> Ten dollars from Kyle Simpson. Another ten dollars for me. Good luck for the Pokemon Blue Run. Can you count this toward Earthbound favorite thing being SDA? Yes, we can. Thanks a lot for the entertaining runs and well done on all you've raised. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. If it used Supersonic, then we would have had a problem. Actually, no, we wouldn't, because I would have just switched out. Yeah. yeah. Once you switch out, that clears all your um kind of minor status effects, like confusion. Confusion counts as a minor status effect, but also like drops in attack and. Also raises in attack and or like all your stats. So that's generally what I do when I get sand attacked as well. <laughs> I'll just switch out to one of my slaves. You mean we'll come back? Yeah, pretty, pretty much. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> well, you say no. <laughs> <laughs> you have like exactly one attacker in this run, right? Like, do you ever use anything else? Uh, no, not to fight. By the way, this Onyx is so weak. Yeah, <laughs> I just killed it with bubble. <laughs> If you're wondering why he's using Bubble instead of Bubble Beam, it's just for PP conservation. Yeah. I, I think I need to use all 20 of my Bubble Beams up here. Okay. A $30 donation from Per Richard Holm. Oh, Jesus, more? On the other hand, if you're wondering why I used Bubble instead of Water Gun, um, you'll notice even though I turn the animations off, some of them actually, like, some of moves just shake the screen like this. Whereas if I use Water Gun, like, it makes the Pokemon flash for a bit. The shaking the screen is actually shorter, so that's again frame saving foundation. Yeah, that's that's one of the things that watching TASs will really teach you on is which moves are like which type. Ooh. Yeah, I could have fought the guy down the bottom who has three rock Pokemon. It would have been easier, but this guy only has two Pokemon total, <laughs> so he's faster. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna have to heal after this fight because Oddish is suck. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oddish is a really crappy Pokemon in this region of the game. Um, because at the moment, I don't have anything that can do significant damage to them. Like, I have to rely on Mega Punch. And I'm going to use that potion I was talking about. Uh, five more dollars from the Englishman. Go, go, Mike89. Props to my favorite Australian from your favorite fake Englishman. I'm the only fake Englishman here, seriously. <laughs> uh, $10 from Ellis Watson, donating for that amazing missing no pearl or. Actually, yeah, can you just... Actually, with how bad my attack is, I might not even one hit these Oddishes. Yeah, uh, BD, guys. Awesome. So, oh oh my boy. Goodness. <laughs> well, you know what? At least you're done with Misty. And you know what the best part of this oh, is? Oh, you know what sucks, uh, too? I can't use Bubble Beast because I've only got thing. one left. Just take it to the store and be like, yo. Rare candy, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm going to use my last bubble beam on Pidgey, which is why I couldn't use it earlier on the Oddish. Uh, Ellis Watson says, donating for that missing missing no perler, also don't <laughs> trust any official game guides. Yeah, we know that one. <laughs> That's my last use of Mega Punch in the run, I believe, so I think I only missed not too many. You missed one, I think, right? I missed two in the <laughs> rival fight alone. Really? Yeah. Or well, the Abra Race run. Well, that one doesn't count because you don't. No, I missed two on the Bulbasaur as well. Really? I actually missed three in that fight. Okay, so I'm going to learn Bite now. And that's going to go over Bubble. I hardly ever use Bite, but I hardly ever use Bubble either, so it's not really any loss. Oh, you got a Dark type move. <laughs> <laughs> I hated that when they changed it Dark. They're ruining that attack. <laughs> so much. Yeah. $10 from Emma Leah. Oh, hey, Emma. Hey, Flying yeah, Fox. Totally. I'm like, yeah, girl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, <laughs> that one I have to press A to select yeah. yes, because selecting no is longer. And I always forget, because I always mash both the buttons when I'm skipping text. Okay, by the way, one really quick, um, yeah, I'll say it now. Um, you might wonder why I bought that escape rope in Pewter. Basically, for some reason, the game treats this as a dungeon. Yeah. And I can escape rebellion. Yeah. Yeah. Now, there are a number of other places I can escape rebellion in this run that's faster to do so, but I'm going to get Dig in a moment. So I don't need it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> going to heal up again to get more bubble beams. Uh, $10 from Solmaz Farad. Can you please say that Ferris Badwan is the best member of the horrors? I just did. <laughs> there you go. Uh, Forty dollar donation from David Kasperzik. Looking forward to Vengeance on Venonat this year. SMK will be <laughs> redeemed. Well, no, no, not really, no. <laughs> <laughs> SMK should have just waited it out for the Aver or the Jigglypuff there. <laughs> Jigglypuff, really? Yeah. Jigglypuff can learn. It's probably more common than Abra. Yeah. Or at least oh, easier to catch. Easier to catch than Abra is the key. <laughs> yeah. The, the sing is an issue, but that's... Uh, $10 uh, from Aaron Ritter. Use this 10 to buy Ness and Paula some bacon for their trip. I think that means go towards... Yeah. Yes, food, bacon. Yes. That's what I assume. Uh, there it is, there it is. Yeah. Bites 100% accurate yeah. attack and it just missed. <laughs> There okay, you go. that's your one for that's the my food. one. If it happens more than that, I'm going to be very upset. That's a reset, then. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, like I said, I use enough attacks in the game. I'm probably good for it once. Uh, oh, I'm gonna try that all day. Is that some kid's best friend? Damn! Yeah. Oh my oh, god! No, it's okay. It's okay. I bought the wagon. Yeah, for this very purpose. Should I just use Carl Sagan. <laughs> <laughs> If I take experience away from Wartle at any point... Yeah, he needs um, to make it up. <laughs> yeah, if it doesn't get to level 34 by the time I hit the Saffron Rival, I am screwed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, just a quick question. Um, what's the mechanics behind rare candies and the reason why you don't use them? Um, rare candies um, automatically oh. raise your level by one without really increasing your stats. That's basically, yeah, basically every... Uh, fight you get into in the game, there's a little stat EXP thing, and that base stats I was talking about earlier. Um, do not go back in there. <laughs> uh, Dig is so good in this game. <laughs> Dig is pretty OP. It's actually as powerful as Earthquake. Yeah. So, I've got a hundred power attack this early in the game. Yeah, isn't it like a base attack power of like 80 or something? Yeah, the only drawback is the extra turn. 
Yeah. No, no it's a hundred. Oh, it's a hundred? So it's the same as Earthquake. Okay. Uh, there's a forest, hidden forest door here, and I'm gonna... Oh, I missed! Well, I missed the jingle skip, Worcester! <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. If you hit B at the right time there, you can actually just completely skip the jingle that plays there and save like five seconds. Nice. So the problem with Rare Cans is it just like it doesn't push your stats at all? Um... Oh, oh it, it does! Stats? Enough. Oh, yeah, okay. it does in as much as... Yeah. Um, but anyway, I will actually be using two Rare Candies in this run. Because... You need the you, moves, yeah. Well, you have to pick one up in any case. There's one in Lavender Tower that you literally cannot skip. Ten dollars from Caitlin Cashman. Ten dollars from Mike eighty nine. Keep up the good work. Name Evie after me, Katie. <laughs> oh. no, uh, yeah, I might if I was going to get the Evie. <laughs> uh, a local donation of ten. I have. I um. I will say this. I have got. I have got one special surprise of a Pokemon that I plan yeah. to name. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. So if you want to name the special surprise, you can donate for that. <laughs> special surprise. Yep. Bobby? <laughs> <laughs> Is somebody working on the other half of the program? Uh, no, I want you here. <laughs> I need you to help me <laughs> with commentary. Yeah, I, I think you're okay. Yeah, some kid's got a very loud voice. He can just... He, he's just gonna show... Yeah, but I want to be on the couch. I haven't been there, like, all marathon. Yeah, just yeah except for Super you Metroid, when you, you were just as right right useless as me. It's not, it's not very hard to do. Yeah. Yeah. And I didn't oh, nice crit. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. It's like the Red one time when it's actually useful. <laughs> Three dollars from uh, James Donlan. Paula Moriga, Sharks. All right. Also, the SMRP so, drum is pretty cool. In here, I am going to buy four Super Potions and three Repels. So long as they sell them. No, no, this one does. This is where I always do it. And three Repels. Those are for Rock Tower. Okay, so something really important, because I'm about to, um, once I'm done in Vermilion, I'm going to warp straight back to Cerulean, because I need to go back there to start the Rock Tunnel sequence. Um, so I cannot use the Pokemon Center in Vermilion, because otherwise I'll just warp to Vermilion instead. Oh, yeah. okay. Wow, wow that just cool. suddenly yeah. got louder. Yeah. Maybe it's because the game knows you're going to fight the rival and it might your soul. Okay, so. I don't know. So, um, that TM back there is Body Slam. Ah, uh, Body Slam. So I'm going to fight this one guy, who's going to block me from fighting the next one. He's going to block the view. Very nice one. I don't even know what that other guy's got. I'm uh, kind of scared to find out. Is Dig uh, attack based or special based? Dig is attack based. It is ground type. Yeah. I thought okay. it was special. Ground is special. No, it's no. not. <laughs> so, walk straight past. Is that just a glitch wow. in the uh That's not a glitch. Like oh, oh yeah. the sound? Yeah. Oh I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um it's okay, so I'm it. gonna teach body slam real quick. Yeah. So this is ground based, although it's attack based, it actually hits ghost types, right? Yes. yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. I always thought that was really silly, but yeah, I mean, yes. this, this game is very silly. <laughs> yeah. This. Apparently yeah. Carl Sagan can learn body slam. Oh, how about that? Yeah. But it's not safe, but it's too risky, so he wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the recoil damage is um, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to use a potion. But I need to be at absolutely full health once I leave the SSN. Because Surge <laughs> is a dick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is the one drawback to picking Squirtle as your starter. The one major one, anyway. Yeah. Maybe I'm yeah. confused. I think it's the other rival fight that's a problem, right? Uh, yeah, this one is not a problem. Um... Lavender is a slight problem, but Saffron is the yeah, biggest Saffron, problem. Saffron, yeah. Okay, let's see if I can two-hit Pidgeotto this time. Yeah. Yay! Your special is good, it's just your attack. Well, no, <laughs> last time I didn't even two-hit the Pidgeotto. I was only like three levels down. <coughs> um, um. Uh, yeah, so something funny about attack damage in this game. Basically... Oh, I won't hit that, wow. Um, okay, so basically what happens is... The game... Uh, oh. <laughs> I didn't expect, to teleport away. <laughs> I didn't expect it to use teleport. Um, yeah. So the game has a formula that determines how much damage each attack does. And then once it applies that formula, it then 
rolls a random number between 0 and 39, divides it by 255, and takes that as a percentage away. So, there's actually a chance of you doing as much as 15% less damage than you expected. And um, a lot of the run is actually hedging for that. Like, you want to have... You want to have like 110% enough power to kill certain things. Because there are some that will just sometimes work and some won't. Like that Raticate, for example. Please get off the SSA, please. <laughs> yeah, the sound music is pretty awful. How <laughs> yeah. um, did I not skip that either? What the hell? Like, like, no jingle uh, skips. Yeah, no jingle skips, not at all. $10 from Teresa Sloan. This I'm whole sure marathon has been amazing. Keep up oh. the great work. I can't <laughs> wait until the other hits are up. Dude, you, all thought, you wanted to fight that guy in the hat, right? I thought this was supposed to be an amazing <laughs> D-pad. Why did it go up when I told it to go left? <laughs> I was having some trouble with that. I'm going to cat him. Oh, uh, man. $20 from Andrew Schreiner. Thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's uh, like a few seconds and I'll be out. All right. $100 <laughs> donation from Mapler. <sighs> okay. Ninety-two ten. Yes. Cool. I love to get to go check out the Telling truck. Rom to stay away from the runners. They've got nothing <laughs> to worry about. You can come back here later and do it yeah. if you want. <laughs> 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 Alright, make no, no, no. sure we're safe. Rom lock is gone. Oh, you can actually get back in? Yep. Oh. I will show you how to do that. Uh, yeah, towards yeah, the next levels for yeah. Sword yeah. Galaxy. Yeah. During the run or not, I'd like to know. Yeah, me too. Should we have a donation challenge to like see the truck or something? Yes, I will donate toward it. Okay. Yeah, um, oh no 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 no! I'm gonna do all my items once I get oh, to the no, cut push. Is there a quick moment I can put in? Go. Because uh, Mr. Right. K and Herbert, who did the uh, <laughs> two-person one controller thing before, um, have just got the run they've been trying to do while I've been here. Wow! Wow! They recorded their two-player co-op run off Contra Three. Wow! Very nice. Wow! What they get? Yep. So, so, like, so they, I don't know exactly. They haven't timed it yet, but they are gonna submit it because it's Ooh. better. Very good. Oh, so wow. that's what I've been trying all the time. I've been here. Mister K has to leave like right okay. now. So, oh, perfect. So <laughs> just watch the bottom left of your screen. Oh, uh, it didn't work because it actually got the switch. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna save. Um. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't save. Oh <laughs> yeah. Well. And then I accidentally clicked the same trash can. Jeez. Wow. That's like two mistakes in a row. Okay. okay, so yeah, this is more like what's supposed to happen. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you sit around and just... I think we could probably call donations during this here. It's yeah. gonna be a while. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, Five dollars from Michael Loretti. Oh Comment is Mike Loretti. Cool. Uh, right. Now I'm gonna say... I really hope um, it's, it's not in the no, it's like trash can directly so. below you. We got our run. It's yeah, possible to get it all the trash can. Yeah. Nice. Oh, perfect. Okay. You don't remember now for search. Search you. sucks. Yeah, same just like. Basically, okay. That's me, man. Yeah, that's the job. Congratulations as well. Thank you. Yeah, congratulations. Okay, so the reason Surge sucks is because he, um. <laughs> oh, that's why he sucks. Okay. Alright, so, now. His Raichu at the end has Thunderbolt, and Thunderbolt will do like 75 damage to you. Um, by the way, this Pikachu is so weak, I'm not even going to use its weakness. <laughs> it is weak to body slam. Yes. yes. It's weak to getting bodied. Period. Okay, so basically... Um, <gasps> oh, now I have to restart. Wait, is Sancho immune to electricity? <laughs> <laughs> yes, he is. he is actually, but I think Raichu has... Raichu, Raichu is quick attack. Yeah, oh, and... Yeah. And I need the stats. Yes, I need experience. the XP. Because yeah. it would have been awesome to see Carl Sagan just body him. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been pretty funny. Yeah. However, okay. So, that Raichu, what he can do, um, is, uh, <laughs> oh, God, restart. Yeah. It's, the, it's the one on the right. Um, yeah. yeah, okay. So, what the Raichu can do, he can, uh, gym leaders have slightly better AI than, um, <laughs> random dudes. People the, in this game. Okay. Cool trainer males. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So basically, what they'll do is. Um, no, no, no. If you have a. If you it's got a weakness on you, it'll use. It'll only use electric attacks against Wartor. It won't use quick attack or I think agility if it's got. 
Um, so it won't use those attacks. However, um, it can also use items for no reason. Yeah. So, it's got three options. It can use Thunderbolt, Thunder Shock. Like, it doesn't pick the best one, it just picks one of them. <coughs> or it can use an XP. And I got the absolute worst luck, which is Sonic Boom from the Voltorb and Thunderbolt from the from the Ratchet. Yeah. Now at this point, even if it uses Thunderbolt, I am a chance of surviving. Now it uses Thunder Shock, so that's fine. Unless it, unless it paralyzes. Unless it paralyzes. Is it a one hit kill with Dig now? Uh yes, it's a one hit kill with Dig. That's good. Actually, if it does paralyze me, something really funny can happen. If I dig and then then fully paralyzed. I can do whatever I like and it can't hit me because the game thinks I'm still underground. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> so you can now yeah, heal or use a paralyze here. Nice. Uh, $10 from Jacob Bird. No comment. $10 from Francois Darner. Thank guys. Thanks. You. Uh, thanks for doing this great game. This reminds me of my childhood. $50 from Brian Lee. Sir Twig, who did a great run. Yep. He put, rocked it last night for sure. Yeah. Put this towards the file name Whack for a Link to the Past. Also <laughs> looking forward to Cypher destroying yet another game. Remember A. <laughs> yeah, that's another one of those. Yeah. Okay, and remember how um, Bill's place was a dungeon it's before? Also a dungeon, yeah. yeah. What's really funny is in yellow they actually um, they actually fix these two, mm -hmm. so they're no longer dungeons and you can't escape rope out of them. Actually, however, yeah. however, there's a couple of gyms later in the run that you can also escape rope out of. They didn't fix those. Hmm. You're 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 kind of a dick. You just sort of like dug a hole in that guy's floor. <laughs> it's like, uh -huh. what are you really talking about? Stupid. I went up. Yeah. <laughs> Dig up, stupid. <laughs> it's Pokemon fan club. I probably got excited to see it. So you just put a hole through a ceiling. Um. Okay. I need Using to. Dig, yeah. Yeah. I need to get the bike. That's also why you don't use the Pokemon Center in Vermilion. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Twenty dollars from Nico Ranta. Right, so now I'm going to. I was kind of wondering, like they actually do charge you for bike if you don't have the voucher. It's like some ridiculously large amount. Yes. I was wondering if, like, if you hacked into the game and actually put in that amount of money. It's an amount larger than yeah. you can carry. Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. Carl Sagan used cut. Excellent. Uh, Ten dollars from Daniel Rebo. He hacked away with cut. Yeah, that's right. Here's okay. Another ten for the missing no pearler. You're gonna get teleport. <laughs> well. Yeah, it's after this fight. You're actually yeah. about to see something really funny. I'm going to use Dig on these Olishes, and it's going to tell you that it's super effective. It's not. It's not, but... Um, here's Prevent Venonat Foundation. Is that because they're grass and poison? They are grass and poison, and basically what's happening is the the game's checking against the list of um, possibilities, basically. Oh, oh, thank God. <laughs> Being paralyzed here is the worst thing that can happen, because even if you heal it, you don't get the speed back. So you become slower than everything. I would actually prefer to be poisoned because then I couldn't be um, stunned or put to sleep. But yeah. Um, basically it's checking against the list of potential things that can happen. And somewhere on this list is ground is not very effective against grass. And then lower down on that... Oh my god, what luck! Lower down on that list is ground is super effective against poison, and that just overwrites the message. Mm -hmm. But it calculates the damage correct. Oh, what? Wrong move. Oh, okay. <laughs> Very good. Wow. I just had amazing luck in that fight. Um, I would get teleported, but I think you have to fight an extra train. No, no, yeah. no, don't get teleported. It wastes too much time. Don't do it. Because <laughs> you have to actually, uh, yeah, you have to get that teleport. Together. Um, Ten dollars from Alexander Tan. I hate how the AI cheats in Pokemon. Lance with a level 50 Dragonite, one with Barrier. Or how status effects never work against an opponent. It's finally time to take the Equilibrium back with a Save the Frame Society donation that goes towards seasons. Okay. By the way, there's going to be serious time in a second because our favorite Pokemon is about to make an appearance. Oh, jeez. What other Pokemon do we love? We don't Drowsy? Know. Bulbasaur? <laughs> yeah, Bulbasaur. <laughs> yes. Actually, there is a Bulbasaur coming up in a couple of minutes, but... Venonat! Yeah. Star of the show. Yeah. Alright. This yeah. is the one Venonat I fight in the entire game, I believe. And yeah, he just survives. 
so yeah. pro. <laughs> Suck it, Ben and I! He wasn't going down with a fight, but he's down. Is that true? You're gonna fight another Ben and I. That's true. Where? Your uh, rival. Blaine, right? Your rival is your rival. Oh, right. A Ben and I. Oh, right, right. I'm not thinking. Alright, so Blaine doesn't have a Ben on it? No, no, why would he have a venom now? Koga's the only one. Oh, Koga's the only one. He only does in yellow. Yeah. Yeah. yellow. Anyway, this is the rock tunnel, and this could uh, go really. Okay. Oh, hang on. I gotta get my repels up the top, so. Yeah, I got, I got Blaine and Koga confused, so. Why does the bike go faster up and down and inside the side? I just keep track of it. It's just the way the screen is. Okay. Like, there's more tiles. Side to side, then up and down. I think. Okay. It's not as dark as I remember. Maybe it's because like Game Boy <laughs> screen was darker. Yeah. Maybe. Well, I, I don't know. I still think like, it's pretty dark. Like someone save batteries. Yeah. Never. What works. you can actually do is you can um, at when you load the game up, you can load it up with different color schemes, and some of them make the make it really easy to see what's going on. Fully paralyzed. I like that. Oh, you jerk. So Koga just has the Venom Moth then? No, he doesn't have no. any of those. No, he's oh, really? coughing and wheezing. I think in yellow he has and the muck. Oh, okay. Coughing, wheezing, yeah. muck. Yeah, yeah, coughing, uh, coughing, coughing, muck, muck, coughing, wheezing. Yeah. Oh, the cartoon lied to me. <laughs> well, no, they changed it in yellow to do yeah. that. It's like Venom, yeah. Venom, 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 Venom. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, this is also definitely Ninja yeah. type Pokemon. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Five Another paralyzed. It's more of a ninja than muck. <laughs> what actually sucks is, yeah, that. I am considering switching out here. Yeah, I think I will. Are you gonna put Carl Sagan on point? I should have actually, shouldn't I? But the thing is, Pidgey will die to an attack, which is, which means I don't have to waste a turn switching back in. Um, five dollars from Andrew Myers Donahue. I swear to God, if you confuse me again. Oh my God! <laughs> All right, Carl. <laughs> Carl? Nah, I can't do it twice. Sure you can. Wow, this this guy takes a hit. No, slowpokes have stupid uh, like defense. That was lucky. That's his only Pokemon too. So yeah, slowpoke seems like the anti war total right now. He's like high defense. He's water type and has the psychic coming. What the? Run. Ten dollars from John Obershelp. Insert joke about SMK and teleport here. Yeah. There's been many. There's been <laughs> been a few. You actually need to like make a joke about that and. <laughs> I'm not going to do Wordish. it for you. Yeah, um, these suck too. Uh, what will I do? I'll body slam first. Because you can't kill these in one hit. Unless you're critical, obviously. Uh, $30 from Mattis Nilsson. It's a trap. That's not the worst thing in the world. It actually doesn't do that much damage. $11 from Adam Kaczynski. Good evening, gents. Loving all the runs so far. Pokemon Blue is great. Great work, Mike. Here's eleven dollars uh, for naming you know, Link's past black. Here because which is clearly the best name I've ever given. Okay, so now I'm gonna use the next repel. You can actually use repels over the top of other repels in this game. In later games, it doesn't let you. Uh, thanks to Oxwas for that. Um, okay, yeah, there's a trainer there, and there's another one here in the row below that. Would Jake Dunnish do this blindfolded? <laughs> yeah. It'd be too hard. Like, on the bike, it's harder to count tiles. So. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, Fifteen dollars from Brooke Fenkel. Great runs and a great cause. I'm in it to fight cancer and also for some plushies. I'm learning a lot on this Squirtle run. Blue version for the win. Highly superior to red. It is the superior version. Because you can get Tauros. Tauros is so good. I think both versions get Tauros. Really? More, more importantly, Sandshrew, dude. But Carl Sagan's in this game. But no, I mean, it's like Pinsir and Scyther. Though. Yeah, Pinsir and Scyther. Pinsir and Scyther, that's what it is. Yeah. I believe Blue gets Pinsir, right? Yes. 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 Blue gets Pinsir. I never caught either. Better than Scyther. I never caught either of them. So. It's because they're in the Safari Zone. Yeah, it's because of Safari Zone. Yeah, and like, how do you catch Tauros? Seriously, that's like impossible. Impossible, absolutely. Or how about like catching a Clefairy? Or not Clefairy? Uh, Chansey. Chansey. Okay. Chances aren't bad because you can get them in like Unknown Dungeon at uh, level 60. Or you can just use the uh, Cinnabar Island glitch. Shh. <laughs> Actually, I think my friend's red version was glitched, so it's completely impossible to catch Chansey. 
Um, five dollars and sixty-nine cents from Chester Brown. Good luck, Mike eighty-nine, from your best friend Sonic and Amy from TSC. Sonic AD and Amy. Oh. Um. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, and then at some point his Mewtwo evolved into a Kangaskhan, and then the game's count broke. <laughs> Okay, so this is the last trainer in the rock tunnel, and I'm out unscathed, which is fantastic. Ten dollars from Tim Wheeler. It's Wheels again from SDA Forums, looking to get the missing little perler and the 200 rare candies that come with it. <laughs> you guys are the very best, like no one ever was. Thank yes! You, sir. We should actually, like, give, like, a big giant pile of, like, like wrapper candies. Yeah, <laughs> so, <laughs> dude, we totally should. They wouldn't be rare at all. Huh? Well, they're, they're not they rare They were in this rare. Game. They were rare at one point. Missing note came in. Yes. So, wait, are there no random encounters in Rock Tunnel? Uh, I used Repel. Right, right, yes. That, that was uh, the other thing uh, between red and blue, right? The Growlithe? Uh, Vulpix Growlithe, yeah. 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 I think blue had Vulpix. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's one point of red. Uh, $10 from Ian Green from Robo Sparkle. Good luck on Surge, Mike 89. <laughs> You've been doing great so far. Can I donate this money to get you show the SS and truck? Okay, we'll do that. Um, okay, cool. Oh, well, 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 how much uh, should we put towards the SS and truck? Alright, now this is really, really important. I need to get yeah, like, yeah, the nugget in here. It's on the second row. I'm trying to remember where it is. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, how much do you think we should have as a donation incentive for the truck? Oh, like, you've got like an hour to less than an hour until I'm going to do it, so maybe only 50 Yeah. $50, there we go. Uh, we were already 10 in, so $40. Sweet, okay. Uh, this Pokemon Center is basically going to be my hub for the rest of the game. It's a nice little area because I can use it to go to Fuchsia, Ooh. I can use it to go to Saffron, Ooh. and I can use it to stay here. <laughs> um, speaking of staying here, right now I'm going to do my major shopping trip. This is uh, probably like it's the most important part of the run to plan, right? So, what I'm going to do. So I'm going to go up to level 4 for starters. Yes, you are, I can see you keeping count there. Yes, this is level 4. <laughs> um, okay, sell. Anything I don't need for the remainder of the run. They have super potions. So. They do have super potions. Um, Paralyzed Heals, I don't think I need them more. Yeah. Okay, while he's buying and selling, I'll do some... Donations here. 11 11 from John Adams. Hope I get him missing no. Right. Good and I buy a Poker Doll here. If you're not familiar with this game, you might not know why I'm buying a <laughs> Poker Doll, but that'll become apparent pretty quickly. Yep. Yes. Uh, $10 mm. from Shane Del Rio. Does the missing no perler come with Water Gun, Water this Gun is Sky the most important part. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what is 8? Eight? Eight, uh, 6 is attack, all the others are 8. Also, another reason not to use rare candies right when you get it is because the higher the level you are when you use the rare candies, the more experience it's worth. Yes. Yeah. Put no X defend? No X defend. How Who needs X defend? On, are you planning on surviving? Um, being awesome. <laughs> and right. killing things in one hit. <laughs> right, so how are you actually in surviving? Being well, awesome? Yeah, being awesome and you're killing things in one hit. Yeah. And being Blastoise, where it's high enough defense and reasonably high spell. I'm uh, also gonna get Ice Beam. Yep. Which becomes. Another reason why Blastoise is awesome. Yes, yes, that is true. The way that you beat the rivals Venusaur. And a bunch of other Pokemon. Yeah. Actually, I'm never gonna use that move on Venusaur. Oh, really? Yep. Really? Oh, you'll see. Okay, <laughs> I buy from both here. I'll well, buy here. TMO5, Mega Kick. Which is an incredibly inaccurate move, but <laughs> I only use it once without X accuracy applied to it. Um, no. Super Repel. I need 9 for the rest of the game. 
And that's all the shopping I have to do. <laughs> you don't need to clap that, seriously. <laughs> uh, 11.15 from Ryan Rivitzer. Donating for Pokemon and for that missing number. That thing looks too good. Indeed it does. So you, so there's like a legend behind where missing note came from, right? Well, it came from an old dude who teaches you how to catch Pokemon. No, I'm talking about the reason why Missing Note's <laughs> in the game to begin with. Well, it's not really a legend so much as it's just kind of like a programmer yeah. failsafe for certain situations that they didn't expect to come up. Mm. Okay, so now I have Fly and I'm gonna do a bunch of things. No, right I, I was thinking of like the rumor of like the missing evolution. No, no. <laughs> it's, well, I mean, it could be, but I mean, the only real pragmatic reason for it is that. It was probably just some debug code that was left over in the situation where when you pull up a Pokemon in a random battle and it accidentally didn't give you one of the 150 Pokemon. Um, I guess. Hmm? 151, sorry. My bad. And scroll back. Oh, I didn't I should have done it the other way. Uh, ten dollars yeah, from Mark Wolf. I speak. <laughs> First time I I've caught an SDA marathon, it's been amazing. Three. Special love goes out to Mike, as he is a great host who explains what he is doing brilliantly for those of us who aren't familiar with the game and its glitches in question. And now it's time to fly to Lavender. Sweet. There's no glitch run. There are no glitches. <laughs> oh, you'll see. <laughs> we'll see. You lied. It's a <laughs> low glitch run. Low glitch. These are sort of like the it's pre a glitch, pre mu glitch glitches. It's like a well, I mean, script. it's it's more that you know the game is just incredibly glitchy as it is. Like, yeah, it's not. <laughs> it's not really me abusing glitches. It's me trying to avoid, <laughs> oh, kind trying, kind of trying to cover for glitches. <laughs> um, okay, so I use one of each in this fight. I think I'm going to use a accuracy, a speed, and a special. To um, keep up for the same attack. Yeah, okay, so once I use an X accuracy, my accuracy is 100%. Even if it uses a sand attack on me afterwards. I always love when they do Whirlwind or Teleport or something. Or free... Yeah, well, this Pidgeot, like, Pidgeot, no matter what you do later on, he's really weak. Yeah. No matter when you run into him. He's, he's a great lead. Oh, jeez. Someone's been training. <laughs> What's really funny about this Gyarados, he's got so many moves he shouldn't have at level 23. <laughs> and he uses Leer of all of them. Well, even Leer is one he shouldn't have at level yeah. 23, but the guy's got uh, Dragon Rage, he doesn't get that sort of force. Dragon Rage. Yeah. <laughs> and Dragon Rage is actually quite scary at this point in the game. Yeah, because of the set amount of damage. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, what is it? It's like 100, It's 40. It? Oh, it's 40. 40. Okay. Mm. Well, Nightshade is based on your level, which in competitive play is always 100. Yeah. So. $10 from Nick Stolk. I remember back in 1999, a friend of mine showed me a trick how to catch a rather odd Pokemon. Of course, I'm referring to the famous Missing Note. Naturally, the trainer sprites all became glitched up and the Missing Note screwed up the Hall of Fame as well. However, up until this day, Missing Note is still in my Pokemon team. And if you were wondering, my Pokemon Red cartridge still works. I would love to win the Missing Note 3D Parlor, by the way. I'll just put this money towards the Pacifist Ijibon. Cool. How much is that up to? I always like seeing like the little sprite uh, with the let hat, me, let me look. because yeah, that's like look missing those like logo in the <laughs> Pokemon selection. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, missing that can have any number of logos depending on where... Which missing though it is. Yeah. No, it depends on where you are when you look really? in the menu actually. Oh, really? Um, okay, so I always forget this, but starting level 3, this actually has wild it's, Pokemon. Uh, it's up to $80, the pacifist from? Out of 150 Out of 150 yeah. Okay, there are three trainers I have to fight here, and there are two elixirs I have to remember to pick up. That's one of them right there. Don't let me forget. <laughs> uh, the other one is in the saffron, right? No, no, no. In this, two in, in here. Yeah. Two oh, in two here. in here, okay. Lavender Tower is actually a pretty good place for it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's also going to get me a free rare candy, which is going to be very, very, very useful later on. That rare candy is actually the reason I don't have to grind in the run at all. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Five dollars from our shotgun ninja. Five dollars from shotgun ninja to name the special surprise shotgun. Uh, I love that Dig not only works on ghosts, it's super effective against them. <laughs> yeah, because of the poison. <laughs> 
Well, th that was the thing with ghosts. The ghosts in this game are so underpowered because they're also poison type, which is like the worst type in the game. Yeah, and this it's was so bad. Yeah, and this, why and this, psychic is so good. And this is, this is another re part where like I, I was bad okay, because the show was a hidden elixir, and there's a yeah. hidden elixir there. <laughs> Because it may seem like Ghost like owns Psychic, but then you play the game and Psychic just owns Ghost. Oh, Ghost what's like, really free. funny about <laughs> What's really funny about that is you remember the old trainer's guide in the um, like it was the instruction manual. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, you remember how it said that Ghost is super effective against Psychic? It's yeah. not. It yeah. has. Well, uh, no, no, sorry, it is. No, sorry, go ahead. No, 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 incorrect. There is one Ghost move in this game, and it's Lick. Two Nightshade technically. Oh, Nightshade. What, what about Dream Eater? Huh? No, that's psychic. psychic. Oh, it is. Yeah. 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 <laughs> wow. Okay. Are psychic. <laughs> yeah. There's one ghost move in the game, and it's lick. Uh -huh. If you use it on a psychic type, it has no effect at all. In addition to <laughs> normal type, both of the ones that they screwed up something, it's supposed to be super effect against normal and psychic. It does it's nothing. Not no, 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 no. It's supposed to be no effect against normal. Oh, is that what it was? Yeah. But it's supposed to be super effective against psychic, yeah. and it's no effect at all. Yeah, because it does the same thing as when you use it on a normal type. And then, yeah, Nightshade is only fixed damage, so super effective doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's fixed damage, which means it can actually hurt normal types. Similarly, Sonic Boom can hurt ghost types. Um, $5 from Trace Jackson. Donated $60 last night for Cosmo, but wanted to show support for Mike too. Keep it up. Rare Candy? Uh, somebody was asking for a roll call. I don't know when the last time we did one was. Oh, so exactly yeah. Okay, so as well as doing the actual glitch here, I'm going to show you something pretty cool. This is the one major skip, per se, in the run. I'm going to use a Poker Doll to get past this fight, and it's going to treat it as though I beat the fight. Um, so this is the little glitch. If I go into my stats menu and bring up my Pokemon sprite... Wow, that takes bad. Uh, basically, what's going to happen is that it's going to load the Pokemon sprite, so now it appears to be the Marowak. <laughs> However, I still can't fight it. Yeah. So I'm going to use the Poker Doll. That's kind of neat. Our daily ghosts love dolls. Yeah. Okay, now. Well, it's up three. I don't really like this area. It's like the only time they ever talk about Pokemon straight up dying. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, it's not yeah. exactly you know a theme they associate with the rest of the series, is yeah, it? Yeah, it's, it's like really stands it's out. Serious. Okay. All faint. <laughs> yeah. By the way, ice beams are about to become golden, so I don't want to use Someone any of them to fucking help it. Yeah. Unfortunately, okay. I have to use them on fucking spots. Uh, That's hi. my one, by the way. Alright, uh, roll call. Hi, I'm Boris BB. Mike A9, running the game. Oh, sh I'm, the game. <laughs> I'm here to be made fun of. He, he was too entranced by that Golbat's tongue. I, I think I froze it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm ready because I started psych. Yay! Yay! Kind of important. Yeah. And remember, guys, the camera's kind of far away, so don't be afraid to like speak up. Oh, you mean the mic? Yeah. Yeah, mic, the camera, same difference. It actually was the same difference at CGDQ. <laughs> yeah, everyone remember that? I remember that. That was the good days. Not that this isn't the good days or anything like that. They're wow! Good. They're all good. Oh, That's yeah. how bad my attack is. Yeah. <laughs> is that gonna be a problem later? Um, uh, not really. I can pretty much account for it because I have X items now. Okay. Uh, what do I do against this? I think it's two bowl beams. I'm pretty sure, got, oh, he's got, I'm pretty sure this guy has good special. Yeah. Like, this, this is, is yeah. Hey, this right, is trouble. It, oh, it's the same okay. Time. Because normally you use Mega Kick on it and it kills them in one hit, but the problem is that Mega Kick is incredibly inaccurate. Uh, $15 from Bisquit of past videos. Oh, Bisquit, very yes. cool. Yeah. Charity and video games, how can I resist? I love how good sports the in-studio audience has been during the whole time I've been watching. The commentaries have been mostly quite interesting. Proof again that non-task can be quite interesting too. At least my utterly destroyed sleep schedule can attest to that. Let's hope the best. Oh, and by the way, these ones thing are weak enough that I can use bubble beam to kill them. Yeah. Which is very good. Favorite thing for Earthbound? Tass. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Tass versus SDA. <laughs> okay, so this one I'm gonna try and use Mega Kick on. Okay, I got it. Nice. Cool. <laughs> I'm still gonna die! 
Oh, and Hi Hyper Fang is not wow. fun because it does a lot of damage. And I think it's a high chance of crit, so... Yeah. yeah. And basically, in that in this game, if it's a high chance of crit, it's a 100% chance of crit. Because high critical hit moves are base speed over 64. I love how this Almost rock every Pokemon has a base speed of over 64. Yeah. yeah. I love how this Rocket has, like, this really powerful Raticate with a really good move, but he starts to have a Zubat anchor. <laughs> oh, oh, we got money. We have the money for the truck, so... Okay, sweet. Oh, that'll be a thing. So the one where you, like, constantly re uh, cancel the dialogue and... Or you got something else? No, no, no. I'll, I'll show you what that is. I normally, like, when I've been practicing, I've been doing that same glitch somewhere else, but I'll fly back to Vermilion and do it if that's what people want. Yeah. Uh, $25 from Stefan Johansson. Okay, so now, fly Celadon. <coughs> I'm actually, um, oh, I have to fly Celadon at this point, but later on, when I do the gym, I'm gonna go back to Celadon and go to Saffron City, and, oh, I did, I hit B! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, um, dig back to Celadon, I'm gonna go to Saffron City. It's actually faster to bike from Celadon to, all the way to Saffron Gym. Then to fly to Saffron from Celadon <laughs> and go to the, and go to the gym from there. Nice. Uh, five dollars from Nico Ranta. Now that's uh, now nice. that's a lot of money we've raised so far. Congrats. Also, thank you for doing this yet again. It's been fun to watch, and you are awesome. Cool. Thank you very much. Twenty dollars and twelve cents. That would be a really big ball of water that you can just share with all the other guards. <laughs> oh, I always get this line wrong. It's the one below, not the one above. $20.12 from Christopher Borman. Toward potato for favorite thing in Earthbound. Keep up the good work, guys. Okay, this is actually probably the scariest dungeon in the entire run. Probably music is just creepy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, way creepier than Lavender. Don't buy into that bullshit. So you got both the elixirs in the tower, right? Yes, and I also need to get one from here because I need three total. <laughs> Five from uh, Tarek Sire. Okay. I need to fight this guy because he's holding a very important TM and a very important rare candy. Go on. And a very important whip. <laughs> and a very important whip! <laughs> <laughs> That's unlike any of the other whips. Yes. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna try and freeze it. See what happens. Dang. Five more dollars from Eric Anderson, and a ten dollar donation Done from uh, Magnus Vangos Carlson. Hi, Kenny man. Yes. I don't have enough glitches in my life, so here's another ten dollars. Mm. Of course, they will go towards naming the favorite thing in Earthbound: potato. Potato. Okay, is that right? Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Okay, now I did just level up to level 34, didn't I? Yeah. Okay. So, I'm going to use the two rare candies. And that's going to put me at level 36, which is the point at which I evolved to Blastoise. The reason this is important is because Wartortle cannot learn Earthquake. Oh. Uh. And I'm going to need Earthquake later. Oh my god, this is so surprising. But I want him to stay Wartortle, he's so cute. And he learns his move faster, isn't that better? <laughs> No. The answer is no. <laughs> no. Yes. Yeah, not at all. Now, not... Earthquake and Dig have the same attack power. Earthquake goes off of special, right? No. Earthquake no. goes off of um, physical. Really? It's yeah. just that it doesn't take an extra turn to do. Oh. Yeah. That was still. Uh, and that goes over uh, Bubble Beam. So right now I have no water moves. Yeah. Yes. Are you gonna get any by the end of the round? Yeah, yeah. You I get surf. surf. Yeah. So you need surf to beat the game. Right. Yeah. Okay. So I'm on level ten right now. I need to go down level five. Five dollars from Jeffrey Mason. Nerf none of that. <laughs> nice trick shot. Okay. Hidden elixir. Now I have all the elixirs I need for the remainder of the run. For the record, you can't just like move. If there's like a hidden item, you can't just keep moving and mashing A, right? Like you have to actually kind of stop. You gotta stop in front of it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're at uh, 8,500 viewers. Wow. Pokemon everyone brings them out. Get yeah, high. Right. Everyone loves them. They're Pokemans. Okay, so. Oh, and apparently we're also at ninety-nine thousand dollars. Wow. Wow. Is this going to be the run that does it? Is this going to be the run that does it? Let me check the track. I think it's technically the. 
Okay. Well, yeah, cash yeah, but hundred k so. is still kind of a huge yeah. achievement. Yeah. <laughs> ah. I mean, SNK is a terrible person. I know, it's, right. it's kind of dumb. Like, what, what was the total last year for the 5k? 53. 99 and yeah. a half. Yeah. Alright, so we're half a thousand, or yeah, we're $500 away from uh, from $100,000. Yeah. Wow. You need the one to make it happen. That's right. Snipe that. Someone wants to snipe that. Uh, $10 from John Russell. Sup? Great marathon you guys are doing. Put this ten dollars towards right. Ness being named health, Rain. So I don't Surely understand. rain luck will ruin it. I'm just gonna say. This, okay. this is the scariest fight in the entire round, the bar none. It took us a long time to work out how to do it. I step up because this way when he loses he'll walk straight out rather than working all cool. the way around me. Oh, okay. yeah. cool. It saves like six steps and he walks really slow. Cool. Considering he walks so slow, I wonder how he got here in front of me. <laughs> He, has a he must have he like, can learn teleport. He must have. <laughs> <laughs> he must have like a chair. Yeah, that's a vented that teleport joke, by the way. <laughs> okay, so this pidget really sucks, and quick attack is its best attack, and it uh, well, it got critical. Anyway, I'm gonna use four X attacks in this fight, and the reason for it is that um, the Venusaur at the end here has Razor Leaf. Razor Leaf is an attack that um, criticals you a lot. So it will critical me 100% of the time. That's okay. That's four. Um, and remember what I said about criticals. You can't. Uh, you can't do anything about it. You can't increase your. Okay, so I'm going to use one. Well, I'm going to use Mega Kick. Um, you can't. Yeah. Uh, good oh good. wow. <laughs> yeah, that's why this sucks. By the way. If I get critical hits, um, well, yeah, okay, that one, that doesn't matter because Pidgey can't do anything to me. But if it happens against the Gyarados, I think it's got Hyper Beam at this point. And if it happens against the Venusaur, I am screwed. Yes. Can you even survive Rizu Leaf at full health right now? No, yeah. no, no, no. That's why it's so scary. Alright. Uh, $70 donation from Oliver Hines. Keep on going. Grats from Germany. Thirteen dollar donation from Eric Einerson. Probably my last donation, pushing me up to thirty dollars in total. Would really like that Pokemon cartridge and the missing note. Keep on rocking, you guys. We have a cartridge as a prize too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah there's there's a, a cartridge with all 151 Pokemon on it. Oh, damn it! Right. No way. What? That. Wow. Oh, take it all wow. of you. Say again. Say again. Say again. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, wow. I've never seen that happen. That wasn't even a crit, it just no, didn't no, do it. That was just your low damage. Like, yeah, uh, probably the attack is that low, man. Wow. Low damage. This is gonna be a problem. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to see what happens yeah. here. He didn't use Razor Leaf, his blind whip is enough. He, yeah, his attack is like miserably low. Oh. <laughs> okay. Looks like Venom has your biggest rival, too. <laughs> 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 nah, Venusaur's mine. Venusaur is. Uh, no, actually, Gyarados is mine. Gyarados is the worst Pokemon in this game. That's why I love a Gyarados like part flying, <laughs> which like, is kind of ironic considering my shirt. If you guys can read the shirt, oh yeah. <laughs> I swear to God, when I evolve, I'm going to kill you all. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. It's just biting its time. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think you can learn bite. Did you just need a bite joke? <laughs> yeah. I was like, yeah. Uh, Twenty dollars from Guy Roland. Great marathon. Thank you. I think it's pretty good too. Uh, five dollars. I should get after three. After three, I lose track, I guess. Uh, five dollars again from Emma. I just remembered I would donate money for Mike seeing the Pokemon theme. Right, so, so here you know it is. I'm awesome actually going to use a super potion here. I'm going to go up and use a super potion right now. That's right. Mike That's 89. not a super potion. <laughs> <laughs> Mike 89's cherubic singing voice. <laughs> so, make Um, okay, so. Vine Loop is base power 40, and Razor Leaf is base power 55. Um, that's 55 times your critical hit, times 2 for super effective, times, times 1.5 for stab. Yeah, I'm not going to survive Yeah, that's not, <laughs> that's not a livable thing. That was a lot of times. Yeah. We could have stopped at super effective and then like yeah. maybe a little bit more for stab. Uh, Ten dollars from Michael Utaro. Put this towards the SSAM truck. 
these are all really backlogged, so yeah, we have already reached the truck goal and all that. Awesome. Um, Thirty dollars from Patrick Perry. Put this towards seeing the truck. Yes. And the stuff with okay, the so things with the Pokemon. Yes. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Take that, being so <laughs> super effective. Uh, <laughs> I've actually, I, I have no idea how he used the item on the second turn. That, yeah. He yelled me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um. Actually, you, I can. I've seen better than that. Blaine has actually used Super Potion on one of his Pokemon while it's been at full health. Full health. Yeah. Nice. That, that happens. Yeah. That's one of Blaine's AI bugs. <laughs> it, yeah. It's something. <laughs> This means two X attacks might not be enough for Sabrina, which is going to be a real <laughs> problem. That is... <laughs> oh, Psychic Pokemon. Why must you be part of a gym battle? Uh, Psychic is so overpowered in this game. It really is. Uh, $10 from Taylor Thomas. This $10 is towards seeing the truck S's hands. Thanks for doing this run, I love it. I spent ungodly well, amounts of my childhood nice playing Pokemon Blue, so this has been both a healthy dose of nostalgia and incredibly informative. Even with all the hours I sank into them, I've never seen the game broken down like this before. Keep it up. I'll be watching the stream till the end. Nah, no, like confusion rate is like ten percent off that attack. I can't believe it happened twice in a row earlier. <laughs> ten dollars from Asher Densmore Lynn, who says, "Super califragilistic expialidocious." I'm not even doing well. That's Thank the you. weird thing. <laughs> You're getting good enough luck, like. It can go a lot worse, I guess, is the thing. But yeah, like, that fight there alone goes to show how important the starting stats are. Well, is it the starting stats, or is it the fact that... Yeah, well, okay, so basically, basically, every Pokemon, when you get it, has an internal stat between 0 and 15, and, it, like, it's got its own range for where, where, what 0 to 15 actually means at any given level. And so yeah, you can't modify those. Once you start out bad, it's just gonna stay bad. Uh, Kangaskhan is much weaker to special than to physical, and I froze it. And strangely well, have I got three left? Does I need three? You have got a really good freezing mark. Yeah, freezing is actually good for like text. It's also super rare. Like, it's yeah, hard, yeah, like it doesn't matter what attack you use, I don't think you can get higher than 10%. Like, I don't know about Blizzard, I am actually going to get Blizzard later. I don't know if it's... Ah. Uh... And it was frozen! <laughs> oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> 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 uh, Alright, it's like a cypher like is he a rat or something? <laughs> How many earthquakes have I got left? I think I have at least four. If I do, then I can go do Sabrina now. Uh, four dollars from Constant Mastona. This is named Link. And? Whack. Speak of the devil. Yeah, I'm actually gonna do it now. Remind me to save before I fight Sabrina, by the way. Five dollars from Dustin Chapman. This money is from is for Maximum Carnage. I want to watch Funk Doc run it. Swag, swag, swag. Okay, yeah. <laughs> nice, <laughs> thank you. Um, okay, two, eight, two, two. That's how I remember it. Basically, it's the amount of steps you have to take in each of these little rooms. So that one's straight down. That one's straight down. And here we are. Now you're safe. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm so good with these controllers. So good. <laughs> Okay, this is the only fight in the game in which I will do my stat boosting on two different Pokemon. The reason is that Kadabra is a beast, and I don't want it killing me. It's, um, if it uses Psybeam or Psychic, and especially if it gets a critical, I could be in a lot of trouble. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the X-Speed first, which should let me kill it in one hit. Okay, so, that's great. And I had five. So that should kill it in one hit. Alright. Now I'm going to use my two X attacks on the Mr. Mime, which is much weaker. And depending how much health I have left, I might actually use an X Accuracy, because I've got one spare. And... Okay. 
so I'm going to use the other X attack. Let's see how much this does. Yeah, I'm not going to dice with that. Okay. We just kind of have to hope that it's going to be enough to kill Alakazam. Well, you got a hit there, but it's still... Well, it actually doesn't matter, because Earthquake will basically kill Mr. Mime from zero. Oh, oh so she has a Beano Moth. Okay. That's not Venonat. That's still. Oh, I mean. I, oh. I, oh, that's the problem. Oh. It's, a, it's okay, I've got a full store. But I was, I was asking if Koga had a Beano Moth and he didn't even have I that. I didn't really so. want to burn it just yet, but I will. Just because this is like pretty bad. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, hi. Oh. Yeah, see, that's uh, what I mean. In Under no circumstances is. Um, oh, actually. It really dies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, see, that's what I mean about the damage range. There's like. 15% Okay, here we go. Okay. Serious time. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Oh. Oh. Sorry. It's okay. I still have digs. And Reflect only right, works once. So I should be... Oh. Oh. Well, I mean, you're still going to do I the same amount of damage. It's just yeah. that... <laughs> <laughs> it's, okay. Of a it's okay. At some point, Reflect is going to wear out. Yeah, but your dig is uh, going to wear it too. <laughs> okay, how much is this going to do? Psywave Psy is... Wave is a crap yeah, attack. Alright, so we got lucky. There we go. Okay, so now I've got... Thank you. <laughs> Serious time over. Psywave is... Did you say Psywave is probably the worst psychic move? Like, it is. It's, um, it's one of the weird ones where it's... Mm -hmm. um, like, it's not actually a psychic move. It never goes super effective yeah. or anything like that. No, and it does no damage. Yeah, like, I it's it's oh, somewhere uh, between 1 and 1.5 times your max level. Did she just give you a anyway, TM for side wave? Yes, she did just give me a TM. So anyway, I'm going to dig straight off that because it's faster. Because <laughs> you get the numbers. Yeah, I just remembered that I totally forgot about side wave because I never used side wave. Nobody uses side wave. Nobody uses side so wave. That's crap. I don't understand. Like, uh, $15 from Preston Chatterton. Thanks for doing this for such a great or for such an awesome cause. You are all great people. Uh, so now Shout out to my future. fellow SA goons watching the stream. They get like uh, confusion on Butterfree way earlier, and it's like a million times better. Yeah. Uh, all right. Ten dollars from Alex Albert. I haven't gotten anything done for the past three days because of this, and probably won't until the marathon is over. Awesome work to all the people there, closing in on a hundred k. Can't pass up the chance for the red cartridge, and might as well put this towards the, Mal uh, towards the Mario Galaxy Extra Stars. Thank you very much for your donation. Another ten dollars from the Englishman again. Oh, Here's yeah, ten bucks yeah, towards that, everyone yeah. in the room shouting teleport. The T is silence in a Cockney accent. <laughs> the next time Mike eighty nine uses teleport, I don't know if they actually use. I never use teleport. Teleport. <laughs> well, teleport. Next time Mike eighty nine uses surf. All right, we'll shout teleport. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, so this is the nice and cruisy part of the run. Yeah, I always Taking like the this part. Taking the scenic route. A hundred fifty dollar donation for or uh, from Damian Allen. Uh, nice. Donating to knock Lunk out of the top for Oracle of Seasons. Oh. Donating to name the file Thrill House in caps. Thrill House. <laughs> Abbreviate yeah. as desired. I always thought this part of the game was weird because like it just randomly became hilly, like having hill physics just for yeah. like that one area. Yeah. So what's the bike path? You want to go fast. Whoever's entering that new name, it's T R L H S. We figured it out last year too. Well, it depends. Have you got six characters? Five for Oracle. Oh, it's Oracle. Okay. Yeah, it's a five. Actually, Link to the Past only has four. So what am I talking about? No, it's only the German version that has four, isn't it? No, no, no Link to the Past. Oh, I see. Yeah, no, which yeah, is yeah. playing German on Japanese. Is four. Yeah. Uh, Ten dollars from James. Oh, these Harvey. are gonna suck. You can only just kill these normally, so this is going to be trouble, I think. Alright, fingers crossed here. Uh, $10 from James Hartley. Fun fact, opposed oh, to rational God. thinking, Splash isn't the worst move in the game in Generation 1. It's actually focus energy. Yes. Because of a programming error, instead of doubling your crit rate, it actually quarters it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they, they, they meant to multiply upsides. the numerator by 4 and they multiplied the denominator <laughs> instead. <laughs> hey, in this run, that might actually be good. Yeah, and don't even what? get me started on the bugs with the rage move. Great run so far, Mike. Put this towards the theme song. Already done. Yep. Did it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, a local donation from Satoru. Sir? You're welcome. Yeah, see, that's what I mean. 
Yeah. Okay. Normally, it's just kill it. Yes. Yeah. In fact, we all want this thing. But more than anyone is going to just kill it off again. We all want one of those. So is it hollow or is it solid? <clears throat> it's I, hollow. It, yeah, which means that it'll float in water so we can learn surf. <laughs> Great. <Yeah. laughs> Well, I mean, it learns water gun and water gun. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> I look forward to seeing the ninja-like Pokemon that Koga uses. Yeah. Yes. The slow, <laughs> enormous Pokemon. Jugglers are also ninjas, just so that... Oh, yeah. You know, yeah. The totally inconspicuous in a dark <laughs> room Pokemon. Yes. Uh, $500 <laughs> donation. <laughs> oh, that's Mark. handy. Yes, a large $500 donation from Marcello yeah. Oliveira. I've been watching SDA videos since who knows how long, though I'm just a lurker and never tried to actually speedrun any game of any sort. But I find myself hypnotized by this stream. It keeps drawing me in. Oh well, it's been amazing to watch this. Just keep up the good work, people. You guys are, as Breakdown says, the men and women. I like how, I like how you said he's hypnotized by the stream as he's finding hypnotized. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. Yes. Okay, now I'm going to use one of my elixirs, because basically you use Earthquake on everything in this gym, but, and there's 10 Pokemon in the gym, but not everything dies through in one hit, so... Uh, no, the, oh, Koda's, this, Koda's this is... Koda's right hat here is awesome. <laughs> it's like a headband. Spare of yeah. poison and sleep techniques. <laughs> and he totally has that in the Bow Sprite. Uh, you Probably be better it? off with putting people to sleep with the Venom app. Hoffing doesn't do it. Muck doesn't do it. No, none of his Pokemon have sleep moves. What the hell is he talking about? <laughs> <laughs> it may be that they wrote the dialogue before they finalized the character Ooh, moves. Ooh, that could be trouble. You might want to... Do you have an no, extra exact person? Or does that even hurt? Yeah, there we go. It doesn't matter too much unless it uses like five of them or something. Five dollars from Kieran Weasel. Thank you very much. This game has the weirdest two turn moves. Like, it's on top of Skull Bash, there's a move called Razor Wind, which does like 50 damage and takes two turns to use. Yeah. Like, why? Hey, I don't know. Let's try for something. Fun. Then you have Dave, which is completely broken. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> right, miss more. Love it when that happens. <laughs> Soul badge. Oh yeah. I should have done it in um in the rock tunnel. There's a guy with Jadu Jadu Graveler, and they all have self destruct. So you can actually save yourself a little bit of time if you use if you use Dig first. And that one self destructs, and then it comes up and kills the next one. <laughs> uh, that's, that's like how all the ninjas in training have mohawks. Yes. Of course. <laughs> hey guys, keep donating. We're like $120 away from $100,000. Wow. Make keep it wow. coming. Yeah. yeah uh, I, I bet a, like 100 people are refreshing the tracker page trying to see when we break it, so yeah. I think it just made it crash. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I think that, that, that they're trying to be the one who breaks it. <laughs> yeah, they're trying to snipe that. Uh, well, $5 from Joel Young. Did you guys ever notice that Gary's Raticate is gone when you when he's at the graveyard? Oh, you killed it on again. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the, that's the rumor. You killed the Raticate. Oh yes, yes, that's right. Gary's Raticate. He died. <laughs> Poor thing. Not. <laughs> okay, super repel. And bye. Oh, all right. So we, I think we just made it. I just refreshed the thing, and we just got like a amount of money. So wow, cool <laughs> money you say? So I don't know. It's like a forty. <laughs> like a, a little more. Fifth, yeah, I like my when I refresh that I'm, thing I'm again. Try, I'm trying to remember the SQL to actually like do a sum. Oh, select, select sum, sum bracket, bracket yeah. amount yeah. from donation. Okay, thanks. Semicolon, yes. obviously. Yeah. Semicolon, yes, obviously. <laughs> Um, okay, so I'm going to use another super repel before that one runs out. That just saves the message that says repels effect wore off. It saves like two seconds, but if you know where it's going to be, you may as well do it. Oh, whoops. And now I'm going to get gold teeth for TMO4. Uh, HMO4, rather. Um, I kind of didn't like how these were both in the same area. Like... Why not just make one of them? Why did you need to cram both of them in here? I don't know. 
Um, by the way, you can't dig out of that building, but you can dig out of. Not quite yeah. yet. Not quite yet. <laughs> yeah. Not quite you dig out of the you ground right in front of. You're lying to me. What are we at right now? Stop lying to me. Well, you, I mean, you did. Okay, so now I'm gonna first. fly back uh, to Fuchsia. Um, that's Fuchsia there, not. I'm gonna fly the million in a sec. Let me know when that's done, and I'll yeah. Um, I need to go over here. No, you guys are lying to me. Stop lying to me. Okay, refreshing. Oh, no. no, this is an extra $10. Uh, still, not, still not quite. Not what, quite. How much do we need? Uh, we need like $122.39. Okay, okay, so now I'm going to go to Familiar City and I'm going to show you guys. So I'm going to do this again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do it quick before somebody else does. Okay, yeah. so. Not that much. Like that one. Show um, off the Master Sword, that'll get it up. <laughs> oh, yeah, there we go. Well, right, right now I'm going to show off a nice little glitch in this game. Okay, so. Um, the same time. The game is, the game is kind of weird in how it uh, does certain things, such as how it... Uh, is it here? Or is, yeah, I think it's here. Okay, so. So if I go there, I'm going to teach Surf and Strength. You want to donate for that? Thirty dollars puts you in the drawing for this. It's legit. It weighs quite a bit. Yep. It'll take you ten years in the future if you pull it off a rock. <laughs> seven, seven, right. seven years, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's that is definitely pretty. That, that's the only prize that's a cumulative donations. It minimum of thirty to be in the raffle. Right. That, up to ninety. We'll so now I'm gonna side. save. So it's even got a cool little track. <coughs> and so basically, what's ha okay? So basically, what I've done. Is um, I'm facing right and I'm facing in front of a um, a surf tile. Right. So the game, so if if I select surf, the game thinks I can surf. However, um, the game's a bit weird when it reloads from a save. Mm -hmm. It has this tendency to think you're facing down, regardless of whether you are or not. So right now I'm just going to surf down straight into that guy. <laughs> <laughs> and so you can go past him and back into the SSN. Who knows how it got back there? <laughs> what the hell is back there? Yeah, well, because it's never supposed to leave, right? Yeah! Shrek! Oh, get that view! Oh, get the get view! Get what? It. what? 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 You have to use strength to push it out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Alright. Back to the run. Back to the run. <laughs> I was so mad when I did that as a kid. Other, th other cool things you can do with saves include um, if you stand where a tree, wa a cut tree was, uh -huh. and save there and reload, um, the tree will be there. Uh -huh. You'll reload on top of the tree. Wow. Uh, and then you can okay. get yourself stuck. Yes. Oh, yeah, we got it. Alright, 100k. Woo! Oh, 100,000! Alright, all right, I can clap now. I don't have to, don't have to actually do things. Insane! Okay, one to the right. And then when I see that guy to. Oh, I forgot to use super repels. Idiot. Watch yeah, out for that uh, tentacle. Cool. <laughs> yeah. They sting. Yeah. While, uh, while Mike and I is busy getting binded and all that, let me <laughs> peer through all these donations because we just got a ton of people trying to slant this thing. Uh, $5 yeah, from Damian Allen. Browser crash, so more Thrill House. Cool! Uh, eleven dollars and fifty-four cents from uh, Ilian Johnson for missing those perler and keep up the good work. We forgot to teleport. Oh yeah, we forgot to call that teleport. <laughs> oh yeah, teleport. Um, when he surfs again, some no, when he uses fly, do you even learn fly? Yeah. yeah. Okay, when he learns fly, we'll do we'll do teleport. Sorry, we keep pushing this back. Englishman. Oh well, that. I don't know. I'll use a couple more, don't worry. Cool, cool. Uh, Twenty dollars from Lindsay Walton. Ten dollars from Kevin Taylor. It took me long enough to remember my PayPal ID. Extremely entertaining and superbly played. Keep up the fine work. Uh, uh, yes, I need to use another repel, that's right. Oh, right. That's not teleport, that's teleport. Teleport. Yes, the T is silent. Yes. Or French. Up to you. Uh, Sixty dollars from Mike Brown. Box, I just love how the Pokeballs are turning green when they go past that certain spot on the yeah, screen. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> I had a TV that used to do that. So that's Blizzard. I'm going to use that in the Elite Four. Oh, nice. I'm actually going to use Ice Beam and Blizzard. Because Ice Moves are amazing. Blastoise can learn them. Yep, apparently so. Uh, Three dollars from Dustin Larson. Thirty dollars from. 
Braden M. Excellent runs. Super entertaining. Go built. <laughs> okay. I need all my item space. Ideally, this is the 20th item I pick up and fills up my bag. What this will do is it will mean that any gym leaders I beat for the remainder of the... Okay, so I have 20 already, so I just toss something. I'm going to toss my antidotes. I don't need them anymore. In pretty much every run, this is the point where your item bag is or will be full. Yeah. Okay, so now... I'm going to dig back out. Yeah, dig. OP as well. What's with the letter thing? I have no idea what's up with that. Because, like, clearly it's, you know, you're supposed to do it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, $20 from Steven Wolf. supposed to teleport. $15 <laughs> from Florian Schaefer. You can also Watch. do a funny thing there if you, um, if you haven't got the secret key yet, you can come on there from the from the side of the island, mm -hmm. and an old man appears on the roof. <laughs> um, a, B, 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 A, B, yes. Okay. Well, you could do it a little bit precisely, he involves the meta party involves the Butterfree, so that was kind of a trick question. Yeah, they, and I, yeah. I didn't really like the fact that they added the trick questions. Well, all of these yeah. are kind of trick well, questions, apart from the last one. Like, pretty much all of them are Tomb trick Stoner. questions. Oh, Tombstoner. Um, okay, not that one either. $15 from Florian Schaefer, watch the stream as much as possible, I'm really enjoying it right now. Unbelievable skills and show and all that for a good thing. You guys are my idols. Much love from Germany. Trust me, there's no skill in this. <laughs> there is skill in memorizing what TMs are. Your Pokemon knowledge. Yes. There is no Tombstone in this game though. And Repel's Effect wore off. The uh, best time to get Repel's Effect wore off is, um, you know when you're walking all the way to Lance? Okay. That's the best time to get it. Right, yeah. <laughs> uh, Ten dollars yeah, for so Ivan Palisak. Love you guys. Screw cancer. Forty from Jane Johnson. Thank you very much. I'm actually not a very good mashing. Man. <laughs> Ten from William Tansley. Not bad. Probably better than me. So. I doubt it. Really? Does anyone have a shooter watch? <laughs> 29.30 from Ryan Cole. Yeah. Man, Blade looks so fat on the sprite. <laughs> you better have Burn Heal. You have Burn Heal? I don't have Burn Heal. Oh, hey, look so skinny here. I'm, <laughs> I'm dicing with danger, I swear. <laughs> You lost so much weight in that transition. Yeah. yeah. You know, I was about to ask it's if I cheat. If I was about to ask oh, if yeah, I cheat, so. off. But think yeah, about how did you get? How would I get here without it? <laughs> Walk through walls. <laughs> yeah, I don't have the SMK skills. Yeah. <laughs> I can't a lot bike of bicycles the water. are not are not part of this run. <laughs> yeah, we totally didn't try to teach them teleport. <laughs> I didn't try to teach anything teleport. I learned my lesson. Yeah. <laughs> Rapid Ash. Against the blast toys. Uh, Fifteen dollars <laughs> from David Young. Keep up the good. Yeah, uh, keep up the good work. Enjoying your stream immensely. Actually, Jealous of your gaming if skills. You also, would like that to get my hands on that pokey red card. Yeah. Okay, so okay, so make a note of that, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm four levels under that Arcanine. Mm -hmm. Surf is super effective and it doesn't kill it. Mm. Just remember that for later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that's important. <laughs> Uh, $150 from Owen Treholt. I think this so is too late to be that text the... There. I, so I think this is too late to be the $100,000 snipe. Oh well, but it's money to a good use. Much. Name, link, no. lump. <laughs> Last toys learn fire well, blast. A good yeah. yeah. I don't know, that may right. have been a good snipe. So now I'm finally going to do this gym. <laughs> It's kind of a hedge. You don't really need to do it this late, but it, um... It's no sense risking it, I mean. Yeah. You really could use Fire Blast for this. <laughs> yeah, jeez. <laughs> uh, $10 from Joshua Cox. Thank you very much. Losing tiles. Losing so many tiles. <laughs> so many frames. Chris right. Tompa hit the frames. pissed. Yeah. Every frame. Uh, $5 yeah. from Neil Gore. Yeah, there's, re there's a really odd shape to these trees. They're berry trees. They're just two large berries. And then just branches. And they're shaped like the fairy. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, the gem is shaped like a fairy. I never noticed no. that. <laughs> no, you're wrong. The gem is shaped like a The thing is like... Maybe if, you, if you make like each of the squares... I'm serious. Like no, don't try and save this. You're just wrong. 
Just read donations. It's a square. Do what you're actually good at. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think like the entire gym, if you like blow it out, is meant to be shaped like a fairy. He's saying it, not me, all right? Yeah, no. Both not. of you, just do what you're good at. I don't know what that is with you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm a terrible person. <laughs> I'm good at yelling at you during Bayonetta. You spent all Bayonetta yelling at me. Yeah. That's why I'm good at it. That's why I'm good at it. $10 from Casey Critton. Thank you very much for your donation. A $100 donation from Lupus Olstad. Hey, congrats on, or congrats on $100,000, guys. As a monumental amount, it really goes to show what a kind of community gamers have grown over the past years. Keep doing what you do and keep supporting awesome causes. Thank you very much for your generous donation. See, coming uh, in this late makes that a gimme. <laughs> yeah. If you if you don't one hit it and you don't freeze it like I've been freezing everything, um, then like Vile Plume in particular, like Pedal Dance is pretty scary. And then there's all sorts of status they can throw at you as well, so... Alright. Yeah, to the home stretch! No, I still have a bunch here. That's Keep going. Home stretch. Yeah, uh, $10 from Dr. Cox. Hey guys, just want to say that I'm glad you guys are doing this. Cancer sucks and it needs to be taken care of. This is my last one, but it puts me at one and a third entries for the Master Sword. Keep up the good work. Five dollars from no, Neil Gore. Cosmo's run of Ocarina of Time was unbelievable, and every other run has also been great. You are all doing great work. Keep it up. Thank you very much. Ten dollar donation from Stuart Wright. No comment as of yet. Ten dollar donation from Nathan Moore. Yo, Mike89. I loved your Sonic. Three and Knuckles run, and I'm loving this Pokemon Blue run. Woohoo! A hundred thousand. Okay. Um, Cheers, guy. And uh, yep, yeah. yeah. I'm we'll definitely loving the hundred thousand right now. Yeah, that's. that's uh, yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah, phenomenal is the word to use. Yeah. yeah. This is the best trainer name in the whole game. Cool trainer mail. Yeah. yeah. Cool trainer mail. <laughs> Uh, $50 from Christopher Perry, second donation of the stream, really enjoyed the awesome Zelda runs from last night. Enjoying the current Pokemon run, it was really cool to see the SSN truck. Awesome job, and keep up the good work. This donation goes towards Game Boy Zelda file name of luck. Uh, $5 from Iker Buzzkin? I sometimes one hit days. Like I said, I'm an immigrant. See, so don't blame me. Focus energy. <laughs> <laughs> Getting pumped. <laughs> Critically hit for like four percent damage. Forty dollars from Michelle Fleming. Keep up the awesome work, guys. Oh, nine K viewers. Wow. That's good. Yeah, and that's all we're gonna say about that. <laughs> <laughs> Right. UA has a very itchy fan finger. Especially since Carcinogen is standing right next to me, so... <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do here is, um, when I... Okay, so I'm going to walk out of the room and I'm going to go back in. When I go back into the room, all the trains reset to their original positions. Oh, Nifty. That's actually quicker than going all the way around because those arrows are so slow. So, so slow. It's also part of the reason why skipping the game corner is very, very helpful. Yes. Uh, by the way, I also, um... I taught Blizzard earlier. I need to... Remember, I skipped the last two trainers' TMs. I actually need this one. So I needed to clear some space. And I need Blizzard anyway, so that's a good way to do it. Okay, so, uh, this is pretty free. $10 from Casey Trenton. 100k in 5 days. Amazing job, guys. Really enjoying all the runs. So let's set and break one more donation goal before the end. Thanks, Mike, for using the best I mean, starter. Put this yeah, in if you use the sand attack, that kind of sucks. Really right now, and the uh, for me. Yeah, but now I passed that, it's completely oh, free. Yeah, it's pretty convenient that the last couple of gyms are like weak to water. Yeah. Oh, yeah, shave it. Yeah, very often. Yeah, it's like shadow. Shadow. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's funny, it's, it's, if you play as Bulbasaur, the game gets progressively harder than you know, Yeah. It? So I feel like the game is kind of designed as like Bulbasaur being the beginner Pokemon to like have more of a curve, but... It's supposed to teach you to not use one Pokemon throughout the entire run. Yeah. 
As if. Well, I mean. Yeah. That was a truly intense fight. Yeah, <laughs> truly an epic battle. <clears throat> Alright. So, that was Fisher. So what about Fisher? Okay, Fisher is um, a kind of useful move because it kills any Pokemon slower than you in one hit. That's the important thing here. It's actually based on your speed. Oh. Interesting. Whether it actually works or not. So, I don't know, that'd be really good if, like, Electro or something could learn it, but, yeah. Well, I, uh, like, I've got X-Speed, so I can become faster than any uh, Pokemon <laughs> I want. Alright. So, like, actually has no... sort of bearing on it? Um, oh. well, once you're faster than that, it still only works about 30% of the time. Okay. So that's why I have X-Accuracies, too. Okay. Makes okay. any move 100% accurate. Oh, okay. 100%, of course. Yeah. No, 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 I think no, it actually no, is like actually, actually, It actually guarantees it? Okay. I... No, it just says you hit. I don't know. I've... I've never actually... Oh. Use a super repel in here, so you don't get stopped by a level 2 Rattatar or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! What will I do? <laughs> the other is that kills, like, Drillhorn or something? Uh, Horn, Horn Drill, drill Horn and drill Guillotine. Horn. Okay, now, what are those basically? I didn't teach Fisher, did I? No. no. This no. is gonna be no. fun. Well... Uh, twenty dollars from Johan Carlstead. Aw oh, man, really wanted to be the one who broke the hundred K. My only chance in life, probably. Keep it up, guys. Nerd here in Sweden, loving the stream. Alright, so we love everything to start. By the way, this pigeon still sucks. Its best move is wing attack still. <laughs> so I can pump up as much as I like here. I may fly agent. I may actually yeah. use a second X special. Uh whirlwind. That will, Why um, are you a move? That'll give me some coverage <coughs> against Venusaur. Alright, um, use Ice Beam. That works. Yeah, see, now the question is what am I going to do on Alexand? Because. <laughs> Pray? Pray. <laughs> Sounds good. Uh, $30 like dollars from Leo Brown. 30 bucks in the lame attempt of sniping 100k and going for the Master Sword. Been a great marathon so, so far. Thank you for your donation. I have to use Blizzard. Right, Earthquake doesn't work, I think he's flying, right? Right. And that in itself is the one reason why Gyarados sucks so much. If you could use um, ground moves on him, it would be a million times easier because you could just use Fisher. Yeah. But you can't even do that. Mm -hmm. Relith, um, Surf. Slight overkill, but whatever. It's all good. Now the, okay, so should I use. Should I use Surf or should I use Earthquake? I'll try well, Surf. I, I use 2x specials. Yeah, but I mean Alakazam. Ick. Yeah. Should not kill me. Oh! oh that No sucks. Carl Sagan! Yeah. Carl Sagan, Sagan, let's go! I'm go actually switching out. Okay. <sighs> you can take it, Pidgey. <laughs> Walk you got off. this, you got this. Walk off. Off. Oh. Right. I'm gonna be slower now. I don't have four scores. Really? Oh, this is good. Okay, be now, are your, your, are your X's off now because you switched out? Yeah. Yes. Okay. It is. Hopefully, I can. Oh. Okay. Oh. oh. That's the worst oh, thing you could have done. Uh, I am not going to win this fight. There may be some bad things. Look into your heart. <laughs> this is real trouble. Yeah. I, uh, that's what I was going to say. Okay, okay, so here's well what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to use more X items. And I'm going to need to go back and buy some more. Alright. Uh, $150 donation from Richard Allen. <laughs> Watched a few of these marathons, but never donated until now. Thanks for the amazing work. Thanks for the past file name, Lunk. <laughs> that would be nice. Yeah, that would be nice. $15. That's all because I forgot to teach Fisher. Donation from Ben Bandit. Now it's going to be Surf because Reflect. Yes. Ooh, this hurts. Nah, this one got me. Okay. Alright. Okay. Uh, $5.55 yeah, from Victor Fang. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> okay, now this has to one hit. Hey, yeah. Yes! Alright. <laughs> Good job. Okay, but as mentioned, I now have to go back and buy more. 
Can you dead can you dead pitchy fly? Huh? Do you still need Fisher? Is that a good idea to learn it now or is are you done with it now? I definitely need Fisher for the Elite Four. <laughs> Alright. So I'm gonna do that right now. Let's do that before we forget. Um sixty dollars from Kyle Fox, thank you very much, sir. Fisher goes over as well. So let's fly back to cell phone as much as I really don't want to. Alright, Pidgey, you flew it off. <laughs> uh, $40 donation from D3 no, we don't Sentia, care about a local donation here. Except Marowak. Shout out to TeamLiquid.net and the DC StarCraft 2 community. It's I can um, get behind that. Five. Yes. Down the left. No, this is three, four. that's four. No, I know. This is five. It's just for all Wow. That sucks. Bye. Um, so I've got... You use two extra X specials. Too. Yeah. I need one more XP because I need four of them. I think I need five specials. Uh, I might get one accuracy too, just to be safe. But there's one fight I definitely don't need speed on, and that's um, Bruno. Because Bruno's a joke. Really? Yep. Yeah. What's jerky about him? Uh, water no, type against... Joke. <laughs> oh, a joke. Sorry, I thought you said jerk. Oh, uh, no. Yeah. Just like, People no, have been confusing me with that all the time. No, is it my accent? Yeah, uh, I, I think I it is. You. I had you fine. Jerk. Okay, I'm still not gonna heal up because I don't need to. I don't fight anything between now and and the actual Pokemon thing. And the Elite Four. Ooh. Do you have enough super repels? Yep. Mm -hmm. I need three. Nice timing. <laughs> it's not what I was waiting for. This is what I was waiting for. Dun, dun. <laughs> And uh, I oh. can't stop getting on the bike yep. anyway. No, no epic build up for you. Well, there will be a part, part uh, once I get into the uh, Indigo Plata building, then there is. What my time is, I'm kind of scared to look. Well, he still wants to you know. Did do the SSM uh, uh, oh boy. <laughs> this is going to be bad. Uh, what do you usually average? Um, a lot better than this. Okay. My practices were like 2.15, uh, and the Elite Four takes like 15 minutes. Uh, oh yeah. Well, remember, not only did you get a Pokemon with not great stats, but you also stopped and did the SAS and Yeah, the stats, like, that just goes to show how important the stats are at the start of the game. Mm -hmm. And I should have used the Super Repel there. After this guy, you're gonna cut back to the left, which I always forget to do. Sorry, has dittos actually. You can count a lot of dittos in here. And now, Carl Sagan's time to shine. Yeah, Sagan. Sagan! What really sucks about strength in this game is you actually have to activate it on every new level. Yeah. yeah. Also doing one step left turns like <laughs> yeah. a it is actually a lot trickier than it looks. Cause I got no idea when it's gonna come back. That's like the only possibly skillful thing I do in the entire <laughs> run. Imagine using the Mac back in generation three. Oh my god! That speaking, didn't go left! Speaking of moving as on the bicycle, yeah. speaking of skill. Uh, free experience. <clears throat> We're good. Uh, well, oh, this cool trainer Mel is gonna own you. He's got Ivysaur, Wartle, Charmeleon, Charizard. Really? Yeah. Wow. That, that is a cool trainer. That is, yeah. he is a cool trainer. He traded with someone for all the beginners. <laughs> no, see, he's the reason why there aren't any of those in the game, because he's just hoarding them all. Oh my god. <laughs> Wartle is gonna suck. Can Look you, at my moveset. Can you, <laughs> fisher, can you fisher him? I'm gonna have to X accuracy. Nice. Yes. <laughs> right, so that's kind of a sampler of what you're going to be seeing later on. Yes. 
Uh, uh, he's gonna be a problem. Four hundred dollar <laughs> donation. Oh, wow. wow. Okay, yeah, four hundred dollar donation from Sneaking Mission. I donated quite a bit, or quite a while back, but never attached comments, so I'm not sure if you'll get this or not. If possible, and you do see this, I'd like to throw this in for Thrill House <laughs> for Seasons. Okay, then. All right. Well, I think that puts Thrill House in the lead, is not it? I think it's a competition now. Okay, so as mentioned, every single level, I have to go back and activate strength again. Stay gone. Stay gone. Stay gone. is strong, I believe. <laughs> Look how consistently he moves this. In such a sick manner. Need to use repel. You gonna catch that on Rakuno? Small tres in here. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> there is. Yeah, the thing about Moltres is they actually, um, oh, I need to use Strength again. Um, they actually default it to the lowest possible catch rate, so it's yeah, just it's as hard to catch as an Ivy Saw. Nice. Pull back to last year, by the way. <laughs> I haven't insulted this MK nearly as much as I wanted to. I know, I'm kind yeah. of disappointed. My ego is not, like, falling apart right now. <laughs> I feel pretty good about myself. That should change. What?! <laughs> Why would you ever feel good about yourself? You're Canadian. There we go! <laughs> <laughs> the other problem is I'm kind of enjoying it, so... Who's it enjoy about this? <laughs> There's no skill on the show. No, I, I meant the, the insulting. Like, ah. Um, yeah, I can kind of see that. Five dollar donation from uh, Iker Busku. For once, I don't feel bad for wasting time with games instead of studying for my finals. You guys are doing great. Glad to be a part of this. You should still probably study for finals. Yeah, that's important. Uh, At some point, yeah. Sometime, yeah. Uh, Six dollars for Kyle Fox. Ten for the uh, Mr. Saturn Party Raffle. And fifty toward making the Earthbound oh, Stay gun! Yeah. <laughs> Keep up good works. So when he uses strength, does he become Super Sagan? So yeah, I mentioned this. Oh my god! <laughs> wow. wow. Duct tape. Okay. <laughs> By the way, I'm still interested to know what this mystery Pokemon you're gonna catch is. It's a Kangaskhan. Yeah. yeah. Really? Yep. Huh. I guess mystery's up. Now, those of you who've played this game know that Kangaskhan is really hard to get. Yeah. What's he, what's he gonna do? Yeah, what's he gonna do with? Uh, yeah, I missed it now, let's see. Super sick. I don't think you even have any Pokeballs. <laughs> oh, that's, that's all. <laughs> do you think I'd really try and catch a Kangaskhan oh. with a Pokeball? I'm gonna cover Pokeballs. He's gonna catch him with his bare hands. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, now I just buy as many full stores as I can carry, and I think it's 15. And I have to hit it every single time, I can't just hold it? That's gonna suck. Play this game for me. <laughs> <laughs> so a couple of times, yeah. Totally this, by the way. It's only root planning, seriously. <laughs> by the way, Laurel, I turned at me before she actually talked. <laughs> I did teach fish, you're right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. We're safe. Even you did one. <laughs> the funny thing is, if I hadn't taught Fisher, that fight would have actually gone a lot better. But of course... Yeah, because you could actually use Earthquake. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, so I'm going to use an X Accuracy. Is that enough? I hope so. I'm going to use an X Speed for Jinx. Jinx is actually faster than me. Well, do you need the X Accuracy for Bruno? Oh, I'll, I'll skip that one. Normally you use one on all five fights. <laughs> but I'll skip the one on Bruno because it only matters from a champ. Cloyster has a ridiculous defense. Cloyster is ridiculous defense, yeah. Yeah, that's why we use Fisher. Crack that shell. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. I like how it took you a second to think I'm about that. Like, yeah, I'm just going to read donations now, alright? We've that's been at this for four happen. days. There's a little bit of sleep deprivation going on here. Yeah, donations. $30 from Ernie Zay. Uh, uh, both parents had cancer, so I'm glad to send yeah. them my $30. Think this is a great event and have loved watching it. Also put my money towards Master Sword. Yes, if you donate for anything, if it's $30 cumulatively, we will put you in for Master Sword. You can donate for anything else as well. You're automatically entered as long as you have... That works for all prizes too. You never put towards a prize. It's just right. the time at which you donate. Yes. That, this reminds me of this back in the days when Jinx was not purple. <laughs> <laughs> 
You notice I was able to talk to her twice yeah. before the door opened? Yeah. Uh, $30 from Lucas Labiak. Thank What's you. That? I like that they actually have unique, like, character sprites for all the Leaf 4, but they're not bothered with the gym leaders. <laughs> $10 from Joshua uh, Hypes. Hey guys, love what you're doing. Keep it up. We will continue to use X Accuracy and Fisher. Well, in this case, I'm not going to use X Accuracy and Fisher because I actually don't have enough. Ah. So I had to use the one earlier. That's right. Okay, so remember what I said about the Arcanines? The Arcanine was four levels up on me and didn't die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hitmon Lee and Hitmon Chan have such low special. Yes. They that do. five levels up, they die to surf. Fighting yes. Pokemon are really kind of just not. Not in not, this game, not really. Not talk to you. No, not at all. Hmm. Um, Should I try and freeze this? Um, champ. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try and freeze with the champ. <laughs> yeah, I've had pretty good luck with it so far. By yeah. the way, Blizzard is actually 90% accurate accurate in this game. So much. Well, you used that. Oh wait, no, you didn't. Use that. No, I didn't. Uh, so I kill that. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. Nice yeah. crit. Yeah, sure. Nice crit. Kind of seals the deal. Yeah, one dollar from James Rodriguez, who says, "To that guy who said Erica's gym is shaped like a Clefairy, you're thinking of Whitney's gym in Gold and Silver." Oh, ah, yeah. yes. Okay. okay, thank you. All right, so I need to use an elixir to get my um, fishes back. Um, may as well use a full restore. Doesn't full restore recover PP too? No, it does not. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna run them up to the top. I don't need the bike anymore, so I might as well put it right at the top. And I'm gonna save. Uh, Agatha's kind of weird. Agatha is one of the few trainers in the game who will um, actually switch Pokemon out. Um, the real problem is that her second Pokemon, Golbat, knows Haze, which will undo all your stat ups. Mm -hmm. And given how low I'm running on stat ups at the moment anyway, I really can't let that happen. So, first thing I do is use the X special in, in case um, she pulls Gengar back out. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And this is another reason why this fight sucks. Oh, Ooh. that's trouble. Damn, she got strategy. <laughs> lucky, 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 lucky. Alright. If that Golbat had used Haze, I would have had to restart. I don't have enough. Um, well, that's mostly faster than Blastoise. It is faster than Blastoise. I used right. X Speed. Yeah. Um, and so now I'm faster than everything, so I'm going to use Fisher. The hope is that you don't uh, damage yourself in confusion. Yes. Yes. Or and confuse them more at some point. Now, it, it really doesn't matter, because what's it going to do? It's going to put me to sleep. I can use the Poker Flute. Awakening. Which wakes any sleeping Pokemon up. Um, oh my god! It actually it actually used its attacks in the right order. Wow, <laughs> it's incredible. Agatha is so stupid. She'll normally make. Yeah, she'll normally dream use Dream Eater first. <laughs> yeah. Actually, what's what's even better? This Gengar, the last Gengar, knows Toxic. Um, it's got the same moves as the first Gengar. It teaches Toxic over Hypnosis. So it has Dream Eater and no way to put you to sleep. Hydro <laughs> pop. Oh. Nope. <coughs> Don't need you. Uh, Thirty dollars from Jim Nilsson. Awesome games, awesome cause. Shoutouts from Sweden. Please, I used one ice beam. This is all ice, so I've got five to do. from uh, Mike Brown. This donation, plus okay. the sixty dollar donation I made oh, a few hours let's ago, do it again. are both inspired by my best friend Kristen Ermel, whose mother yeah. Rhonda's okay, Cross Effect wore off in here is the best thing ever. It's it's currently going through chemo. Can they get a shout out? I'm sure they'd be. Uh, no, I think yeah. it's all right. Anyway. So shout out to Kristen and Rhonda. Okay, definitely five. saving before this fight. This is the scariest fight in the entire run. Yeah, Lance and his kid. Yes, and it's Dragonite. No, no, it's, it's the Gyarados. That's the scary <laughs> bit. There are certain things he can do, and you just have absolutely no chance. Yeah. It's especially it's especially Lee into Hyper Beam. Yeah. Right. So this is 
X special? <laughs> Every place, okay. Regular stuff guaranteed 40 I think I'm still okay. So what am I do? Oh. Wow. I should survive this still, unless it crits. Yeah, okay. So, I'm. Um, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna use Ice Beam. Ah, okay. Now I'm gonna use the full restore. So, it's up. Yeah, see, Lee. That lowers my defense. Lee into Hyper Beam is big trouble. This is going to do more like 150 damage. Oh, or, or not. Okay. Right, so now it's dead. And then I'm going to use another full restore. This is why I bought so many, by the way, because this can go really bad really quick. Really. <coughs> okay, now I'm going to use an X speed, not because he used agility, but because of the Aerodactyl coming up. Also a dragon, obviously. Even if that crits, that will not kill me. That's not attempt fate now. <laughs> okay. I should one hit everything. Else. I'm not sure. I'm not sure which is dice here. Using ice beam because it might not do the damage, or using blizzard because it I'm might miss. <laughs> Well, I mean, given your freeze luck so far, it might be the ice cream because then it might freeze them. That's true. Thirty dollars. But I'm not gonna be responsible for that. <laughs> from uh, Daniel Berenger and the Waffle Ma Mafia, and they hey, all like you know that you just lost the, the game. Yeah. Yay! Yeah, I just lost the game. Cool. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Sorry, I, I really shouldn't. Just thirty dollars. Sounds like <laughs> One dollar from Cody Gagnon to say that Trike is falling asleep, you should mess with him. Venonat! He's the real Pokemon League champion! <laughs> <laughs> Indeed he is. Alright, go grab the elixir. And save. Alright, here he goes. Remember, animations come back on, I can't do anything about that. And this has the best music in the game by far. Yeah, I agree. By far. Yeah. Venom is the most powerful trainer in the world. <laughs> Can't stop that, but anyway. Oh, I will stop him just for you. <laughs> Thanks, Mike. Okay. Now, this time Pidgeot has Sky Attack, so it can finally do something that actually hurts me. And it's about to do it. If it criticals a <laughs> Yeah! Yeah! Where are you at, It's hard okay. to aim from the sky. <laughs> Alright, now he's dead. <laughs> and animations are turned on for this final battle. That is correct! Oh, to make it more dramatic. Yeah. Yeah, got the music and everything. Timer at the end of the fight, or at the end of this fight, yeah. Or okay. I thought it was like when you talk to Oak at the afterwards. Nah, or well, that's when the game time is going to be. But normally, when we do races on this game, we just call done after Venusaur dies. By the way, that's the longest animation yeah. in the entire game. I should not have used it. Yeah, it's <laughs> why is it red? Ten seconds. Yeah, why is it red? <laughs> That's a really good question. Um, okay. So, Gyarados can actually damage me. Um, same again, Leer into Hyper Beam is potentially dangerous. This is not at all dangerous. Even if it crits me, I should not die. Yeah. Alright. So now you get to see all of my different moves. Yeah, I basically used two Ice Beams rather than another Blizzard, because Blizzard's uh, less accurate, and he had to wait for the Gyarados recharge anyways. It's nothing to do with that, because I've already, um... Ready? I've already oh, well, used already an Yeah, I've already accuracy. used an Accuracy. Right. And why'd you do that? Because Ice Beam is, um, a shorter animation. Oh, true. 
All right, and here it comes. That's kind of it. That's it. So once, it, so once it, um, once we see green defeated, then that. Now. Uh, <laughs> The villain that is purged from FDA history for all time. It never happened. I was 227. 227, okay. I'll kind of run over time if I do this bonus thing, but do you still want me to do it? Yeah, I want to see it. Okay. Sure. And I'll just finish up the donations here then. Perfect. Actually, I kind of want to By the way, I failed in my end to actually get faster than SMK's time from last year. <laughs> Just missed it. Because that damn trainer in Victory Road. I never fight him. I'm so mad at myself for doing that. <laughs> I can't remember what my time was last year. It was 225. Yeah. I'll beat it. I'll beat it in game time. <laughs> Oh, yeah, because I lost 15 minutes of my amazing hope. <laughs> this is great. Level 55. Hold on, I want to do one, one true Hall of Famer of this run. Hold on. And... Okay. There's a real star. Say <laughs> That's right. 10k viewers at the end of that. Wow. wow. So that's the second 220, so there you go. And Oka's about to tell me that I suck. Yeah. You have lots to do. <laughs> Why would they do that? Yeah. Now, I can't remember where this saves. Do we have a full save file just in case? I don't know. You got the 151 one, but I don't think you should touch that. No, I don't think I should touch it either. Oh, this was a full save before you overrode it. So oh, <laughs> sweet. Is it so happy for her here? Wait, this is where she Oh, no, 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 it's okay, because I saved. Oh. But I saved it like. Yeah. Well, can't you just teleport out of the elite yeah. four? I don't think you can, but I could die. Yeah. I actually can't soft reset here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to reset on the system. No, no, no. Uh, this is my this no. is my card. Yeah. Okay, so this is only gonna take yeah. a couple of minutes. What? Um, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to self and I'm gonna grab the master ball. <laughs> Okay, so where's that? Yeah, so that's here. So I've just got to die in this fight real quick. But then, you're bringing Venonet back. What are you doing? That's oh, because God. that's because the Venonet legend will never die, and you know this. Uh, <laughs> <that hug. laughs> anti-hug. Hug Trihex. How's that an anti-hug? <laughs> anti for me. Trihex is the opposite of my KD9? Yeah, I mean, look. He's black. <laughs> it works. <laughs> Okay, so, uh, oh, this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> so you want to kill him so you can get a more powerful. <laughs> wow. Oh no, actually, I'll um, I'll kill the pigeon because Alakazam will wipe the floor with me. Yeah. Uh, that actually worked. That would. Watch him freeze me. This would be the worst thing ever. Ah. <laughs> Uh, that mirror move was pretty nice. <laughs> I was about to, after you did the fish and you did mirror move, I was about, I was about to get hyped. <laughs> <laughs> I I want to use Fisher, but I'm worried it's gonna hit. <laughs> yeah. I'll do that pretty faster. fast. Oh yeah, I'm not faster. I can't hit. Correct. You suck at reading it. <laughs> no! Stop what playing are you doing? it safe! Herp and derp. There we go. Herp and derp. Is that that better trainer AI you were talking about? Oh yeah, it's so good. Recover, recover. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. AI in this game is rubbish. <laughs> Carl Sagan has this. Dude, only one hook. Come on, oh, let's go. Come on, Sagan, Carlo. you got this. Come on, Granny Strats, let's go. Oh. oh. <laughs> Maybe it'll live? Maybe? No. <laughs> oh. yeah. He blacked out and he lost half of his money. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to fly back to Saffron. I'm going to go get the... 
The master ball. Didn't you just grab it when you were there? No, because it would have stuffed up my items. That's true. Um, oh, the bike's down the bottom now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if I remember rightly, you go to level three. It's been so long since I've actually played through Sith Core again. Well, yeah, I don't expect you to know. Like, because what do you know about Pokemon, right? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, we need a lot more of this. I don't know why why it's not been the SmackDown all, all game, but... I, I've been kind of disappointed nobody's been joining in. Like, seriously. I mean, look, the source material is so easy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, and I don't have Dig now, so I'm going to have to go out the slow way. Should have gotten an escape rope, or, you know, does that actually count as, like, Dig? Yeah, an yeah. escape rope would have worked. But or, you know what other move would have worked? No. <laughs> no, that no. wouldn't, because teleport only works in the overworld. Really? Yep. Oh, maybe it's in Bill's house. Want to get Lapras away here? Uh, no, I'm not going to get Lapras screwing. Yeah. There was, like, a 99% chance of me getting Lapras going into this run. And now I don't have to? Why would I? That's your strength slave, right? If you yes. Mm -hmm. It's strength if I don't get... <laughs> if I don't get sand shrew. Alright. So now I'm going to do a, um, a very famous glitch where you go to Viridian City <laughs> and you talk to this old man at oh. the north of Viridian City and he, um, he does really strange things. Basically. Basically, um, in order to make this little cutscene work... You know, I really don't know how to catch Pokemon. Could you show me? <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, we only no. have two. I have to say I mean... no, don't I? Are you in a hurry? No. Yeah. 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 Okay, no, so no, basically... No. Um, so you, uh, the game changes your name to the old man to make this work. Briefly, like, yeah. Yes. Well, then it never, cha like, it never yeah. changes it back. Is the problem until you enter another load and, Pokemon yeah. loading zone? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to fly to another non-Pokemon load. Yeah. Good point. Um. Yeah. I have an item that takes me straight to Cinnabar. Which, you know. <laughs> Amazing. Cinnabar okay. Ticket. So. Oh, you know what else I don't have? What? I have a rare candy. Let me get one here. So that's okay. No, 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 I'll go to Cerulean and get it. That's quicker. Really? Yep. The one behind the house. Yeah, I know the one behind the house, but isn't the one in the lab faster? There's one in the lab? There's two in the, um... Oh, there's two in the, uh... The in the mansion. mansion. What That's you, right at the end. What are you need a candy for? What are you doing? I, I don't You'll know. You'll explain this in a sec. Oh. You'll see in a sec. Okay. One, two, three, four... I think it's five. It's five, it's five, it's five. <laughs> It was very that nice that is one thing I do remember from my room last year. It was very nice that old man to teach us how to catch Pokemon, though. That was very helpful. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, because I need to know how to catch this particular Pokemon. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's good to get the pointers, then. Okay, so. Now, I'm going to do the famous Surfing on Cinnabar Island glitch. Which causes all sorts of really strange Pokemon to appear. Because my name is Green, um, the second and fourth... I don't know what's in my sixth slot, but anyway, yeah, 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 yeah. I've got hey, a Pokemon I've seen one. Before. <laughs> and M at zero. <laughs> Dash M. By the way, you can win this prize. <laughs> um, yeah, which I'm just about to catch for you. Uh -oh. Bam. Oh boy. Oh, there it is. So I hope you weren't too attached. Did you did you push down B? Huh? You got to push down B. Okay. So okay. So here's the funny thing, right? Um, what was the name you wanted to give it? Uh, Somebody wants to name the special surprise. Oh, shotgun! Yeah, yeah. yeah let's do that. Okay. Yeah, uh, look, look at that battle sprite. That's fantastic. That is ferocious right there. <laughs> that is scary. Okay. So is where this gets really funny rainbow? is that the fight continues. <laughs> of course it does. <laughs> you, you can't hold this thing no back with a pokeball. Dude, use your X accuracy. <laughs> Got to fish with this thing. All right. Okay. So now I'm gonna kill it. Okay. You didn't get any experience from that. Yeah, okay. And, now this is why I need the wreck candy. I am going to evolve <laughs> Shotgun. <laughs> the first hey, Shotgun's evolving. Into a Kangaskhan. From, like, from a Kangaskhan. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You could have taught it fly before. Yeah, I, I heard, like, there's some sort of myth that, like, 
the reason why he exists is because there was gonna be this thing where if Kangaskhan, like, fainted enough, the Kangaskhan would die, and the baby would evolve into a Cubone. So it would be like this weird thing. That's really weird. Anyway, that's that the really run, guys. Weird. I hope you enjoyed it. Yeah! yeah. So next, um, I believe Oracles has smashed Link's Awakening. I believe that is true. Yeah. So yeah, Tomp is going to get his run. Yeah. And you guys will really enjoy that too. Alright, let me run a quick commercial before we get started. Yeah, let's do that and I'm just going to sit here and watch. You ready? Yep, yeah, sweet. Thanks so much. It's been a good sport. I'll touch it down. Oh, do you want to stay first? Mike? I want to save him. I, th no, this is like SDA history now. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Shotgun. Right. I love the missing us spread so much. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Um, there goes the game. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Where's my... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Four snakes. Four snakes. Oh, you sink deep in this thing. You sat right in the middle, too, so... <laughs> Yes, this is very comfortable. <coughs> this coach is uh, so I don't need it. It's I know. Do you see Flicky? I'm totally confused. Do you have a stream? Do you want to get put in this? I'll have a stream. But yeah, I guess you can put it if you want to. It's um, Twitch TV. And then your thump, I think. Is it just Tampa then? Yeah, I think it's... And Tantalala on YouTube. T-O-M-T-E-L-A-L-A. Tom Tell Lala. Yeah, I thought it was. So it's T O on both Twitch and YouTube. You're not sure. Twitch is just Tompa. Yeah, yeah, just Tompa for Twitch. And Tom Tell Lala for YouTube. T O M T E L A L A. Oh, how surprising. Okay, second place. Wins Awakening with five hundred eighty-three dollars. In first place, Oracle Seasons with fourteen sixteen thirty nine. Oh, YouTube dot com slash users. Oh, so Tom Talala. We'll keep that. We want to keep that. Actually, I don't think we have one for it. Oh. All right, time to get a little caught up on donations. Yes, Jed says. I'm saying, I'm yeah. saying hi to Jacob, my friend. Is I think he's watching. Okay. <laughs> 2.30. Oh, wait, is the name file a... Uh, yeah, what's the name file? Okay. Obviously. Period. Okay. <laughs>